Fuck, we can't play that music. Stop, 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 stop. Oh shit. Fuck. Okay, listen. Um it's the stream is starting soon. Someone's doing Someone's I don't know if you can hear it, but someone's playing they're fucking drilling downstairs. Someone's fucking drilling below me right now. So it's gonna be a second. Also, we can't play that last music. I did wait, fuck, this is Nintendo music too! Shit! Fuck. And now it's yeah. Uh, uh. It's all ruined. It's all ruined anyways. Why not on Twitch? Because I get more viewers here. And it's more fun that way. Um... Okay, I think there might be done drilling. Yeah, drilling me from behind. That's exactly what it is. GGG. You would know about that. You would know all about that, sir. I think there- I think- I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna- I'm gonna be right back and I'm gonna tell them to, um, be quiet, please. Because I'm- uh, no, I'm not gonna go get drilled. That's not where I'm going. I'm going to go ask them to be quiet, please, is what I'm going to do. Twitch era was peak. Dude, I should... Can you hear that? Can I get... It's going right now. They're drilling right now. Can you guys let me know if you can hear that? It doesn't look like my mic's picking it up. Okay, looks like you guys can't hear it. Okay, then I'm fine. I'm just still gonna go down and be like, hey, be quiet, please. I'll be right back. Ten seconds. Shut the fuck up. Okay, anyways, I'm back. How's it going, fellas? Wow, live stream, eh? I told you I was back. I told you I was doing live streaming again. So I didn't do a single live stream while I was in Japan for six months. Came back, I did one like two weeks ago, and then I had to unlist it for various reasons. Um, or private, for various reasons. Because, okay, the reason was... 
that I did like so I've I revealed my face before on this channel, but it's like it's like an unlisted stream now because like I don't know I I revealed it and then like a lot of people were like actually we don't want to see it, so I was like okay whatever unlist it, but like I left the link there for anyone who wanted to see it. Um, and then so in that stream I was like maybe I'll put the face the webcam on who knows you know, um, and so at the beginning of that stream two weeks ago I was like testing my my face cam with uh with rooster with the, the the mod and then when i you know i didn't i didn't actually wind up showing it in the stream and then when i when i p finished the stream and i published the stream it showed like the preview like the before the stream happened like all that shit of me testing the fucking cam with my mod so it was like super awkward so i, I privated it uh okay questions about japan i see them uh did you try any fancy toilets in japan Dude, you don't even know you don't even know bro there's this little thing they have in japan and also many other parts of the world um i don't know if you've ever seen this kind of thing before that's the wrong fucking screen god damn it one second fuck fuck you guys weren't supposed to see that you weren't supposed to see that fuck is it doing one sec hang on okay there we go they have these things in japan hang on look up let me just look up Japanese bidet. Oh, I love these things, dude. Dude, so it took me a while to kind of like work up the courage to use one of these. Is she using it? Oh, she's just looking. I thought she was like standing there just like pissing at it. I was like, what the fuck? Um, yes, yeah, so we have one in my house. Uh, like it came with the place. Um, and it took me probably three weeks to work up the courage to use this thing. But I did it. I did it. I worked up the courage, uh, and I could never go back. It was scary, dude, because I didn't want to, like, you know, I didn't know, like, how, like, I didn't know how, like, strong the water was going to be. It was going to be cold. No, it was not cold water. It was nice and warm water, and it was very gentle. You could just, like, adjust the pressure. Um, what on earth? Um, and I got hooked on that thing, and I swear, did I miss it so much. Were there any good cheeseburgers in Japan? Absolutely not. The thumbnail is clickbait, by the way. Uh, hey, Sue's not out. I just put it on, like, oh, here's two fucking whatever roguelikes that people are probably excited for. I put the thumbnail on there. Um, yeah, there's no good cheeseburgers in Japan. I fucking, dude, Japanese McDonald's is so overrated. It's just as shit as American McDonald's. It tastes terrible. The meat's fucking terrible. It's just like, it's just like American McDonald's. Like, they have, oh, wow, they have the different fucking flavors, I guess. I don't know. I thought it was so overrated. I went to McDonald's one time. I was like, okay, never again. Um... Okay, now you definitely sound like someone who would get drilled up from behind. Is that because of the bidet thing? That's a little bit rude, I think. Um, <clears throat> Japan Burger King? I don't think they have Burger King. I remember seeing one. Um, have I heard of Noida? Roguelite. Okay. So, listen, I got a couple of things that I would like to go over first. Because I did, I did some other things. Yeah, the, we're going to get to the, the, main, the main event. Here's what the main event is, essentially. We have a wheel here. This wheel has the name of several roguelike games that I have may or may not have played. Essentially, what we're going to do is I'm going to roll this wheel, spin this wheel, like so. And whatever it lands on, I will be playing that roguelike. And if I lose the roguelike, we spin the wheel again. And we keep going until I win. I'm locked here until I win. Until my... Uh, I don't expect this stream to take to, to last very long. I have some stuff planned after this because uh, I just expect to win like the first first or second time. Some of these I have played. Now here's the the best part. I, some of these I have literally played for like hundreds of hours. Like like I know life. Some of these games and some of these I've never opened in my life. And there's a bunch of ones in between as well. The fun part is that you guys don't know which one is that, which which the ones those are. Um, so this could be uh, very easy for me or very very hard depending on what we roll here. Um, and I'm thinking of <coughs> I'll run some polls. Uh, and depending on the outcomes of the polls, I might add some of these in extra. Um, so, like, I'll run a poll and, like, um, watch I'll just, like, have all the names on there. And whatever, guys, when you guys pick, we'll add it in there again um, to, like, increase the chances of getting it. Or actually, I'm pretty sure you can just, hang on. I think you can just straight up increase. Oh, yeah, you can just increase the probability. Look at that. We'll just do that. Um, we cancel. Yeah, we'll do that. 
Yeah, uh, so he's got a win with Dead. So there are a couple in here. That's another thing I wanted to mention. Uh, thank you for bringing that up. So a couple of these are rogue lights and not rogue uh, likes. So like, you know, like Dead Cells and Hades, you kind of like, the game slowly like makes you better as you go. It gives you like permanent upgrades and to like, to um, make up for that, uh, I have not practiced these games at all. I have not played these games in probably two years, both at, like Dead Cells and Hades. I just, I've not opened them um, to kind of like try and make up for that. The fact that I will have like a, a natural advantage with some of these other ones, which I won't tell you which, I have uh, increased the the probability of, uh, or I have I have I have practiced. But you guys don't know which one those are. Other things that I want to talk about first, though. I should do a fresh save on the roguelikes. Absolutely fuck not. Absolutely not, bro. Uh, where's Wizard of Legend? So the reason Wizard of Legend is not on here, and I might add it later, uh, depending on how I feel. Um, Wizard of Legend is not on here because I did this the second time I've actually done this. I did this about a year ago on Twitch. Um, and I won using Wizard of Legend. And obviously the, the goal of this is to turn this this stream into a video and post it on the live streams channel. Uh, and last time I did this, I won by playing Wizard of Legend and beating Wizard of Legend. So I'm like, that would be a little bit kind of lame if I just did the exact same thing twice. Because I do, I like, I have Wizard of Legend down to a fucking science, bro. You don't even understand. I literally, I can't lose this game. Steve says I have only 16 hours. I have much more hours on my Switch. Um, and also want a slightly less than legal version of this game that I also may or may not have downloaded at one point. Um, this game is a fucking science to me. And I cannot lose it. I swear to God. So that's why I don't have it on here because it's kind of lame. But if the stream starts to go too long, I'll definitely add it. Absolutely. Um, so thank Jan, Jan Nahami. Why do you have a fucking annoying ass name to pronounce, bro? Uh, yeah. So one of the things I wanted to talk about is the Wizard of Legend 2 trailer. Another trailer dropped yesterday. Tra and I have some opinions on it. <sighs> Guys. Uh, I'm not feeling too great about Wizard of Legend 2 anymore. <laughs> Fuck. We'll oh, oh, play the trailer. And also, there's, like, a live stream that I did afterwards that, like, some things, man. I, I'm i still, I'm still like, so high on Copium. Uh, Hopium, I suppose you could you could call it. But some things in this trailer and in, like, the live stream they showed, I'm like, what the fuck are you guys doing? Um, so, anyways, here's the here's the trailer. First of all, voice acted, and it sounds fucking terrible. The voice actors are so cringe, and they... Uh, <clears throat> and it's like, it's honestly the voice actors aren't as bad. It's the writing. It's people who wrote the fucking lines. It's so this terrible. Easy to learn, hard to master. Maybe the contest this looks cool. This looks cool. I think these spells look cool, but also all of these are in the first game. None of these are new. Smell that burning. That's the scent of failure. That's the scent of failure. Like Shut up! Why? 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 That's cool. That's a new one. Gets me all tingly. Like, like, they spend actually eight seconds thinking of these lines, dude. <laughs> Welcome to Deadsville. Population her. Can we spend more than more than one millisecond thinking of the fucking lines man whatever it's not the actual game it's just the trailer it's just the trailer i'm gonna fucking i'm gonna contain myself i'm gonna contain myself um and we're gonna keep watching okay some things that i thought were cool uh that enemy looks kind of cool ah uh, fuck there was like the, the big boulder and shit and some other thing that they mentioned in this live stream that i'll, I'll talk and I'll talk about in a sec now these four have the right idea any rules against teaming up here's my other issue what the fuck is happening on this screen? Like, what is going on? <laughs> okay, so the new art style, I don't have an issue with it. A lot of people are very upset about this art style because the old one is like very, okay, maybe the old one is much, it's, the old one is just superior. The old one looks so fucking cool. The pixel art is very, very nice in the original Wizard of Legend. Um, the, I think the thing like, but if, I mean, it's obviously very hard to make like pixel art like this, you know, um, that looks this good. Uh, for, like, all your different, like, spells and shit. So I'm okay with them using a different art style if it, like, saves them development time or whatever. But the thing about Wizard of Legend that I think they might be taking for granted is that it is very, very easy to always see what's going on on the screen. Like, your wizard is always in the center and he pops out like a motherfucker. It is, like, never confusing and, like... Um, some of these, like... 
trailer footages are different, but as long as you're like in single player, your character is always at the very center of the screen and he never moves. And so it's always very easy when there's all this like magic shit going on. It's very hard to lose yourself. Like, you know, like you don't, you don't know what's going on. Like you, you can't tell like where you are. Uh, and this new art style is very reminiscent of Magicka 2, another game that I very much like. But the thing with Magicka 2, if you've ever played this, especially with friends, this game is an absolute, like it's a fun game. I love Magicka 2. But it's a fucking clusterfuck. It's, it, like, you, like, if you've played it, you understand. Like, you start getting a couple of spells out there and you just completely lose where you're standing. You have no idea what you're shooting at. Like, you have no idea if you're alive or dead. Um, but they make up with that. They make up for that by being, it's not a very hard game. It's, so it's not very punishing. Um, you know, so like if you lose yourself and you die once, your friend can just instantly revive you. It's no issue. Um, Wizard of Legend is not like that. It's a little bit more of a punishing game. And I'm worried when I see this, and I have no idea what's going on, I'm like, how is this going to be playable? Nope. Like, like, imagine you're playing as this guy, bro. Like, imagine you're playing as this guy right here. And, like, you're just trying to, you're just trying to play the game, and you just completely lose yourself. Oh, I worry about this. I worry. But also, it's, you know, it's trailer. It's still in development. This is just a trailer. They might have changed things for the trailer. Like, I don't, I don't know. Um, I think... If it's a four-player thing, if it's local multiplayer, it's going to be a clusterfuck and impossible to tell where you're, where you're even standing. But I think if they have, like, connecting to an online server and each, like, individual person's character is always at the center of their own screen, then I think it could be better. Um... Incredible. The best I've seen yet. But to win, it would be <coughs> a champion. A master. No. A legend. A legend. Wow. So, that happened. Um... Other than that, I think th there's a couple of new spells they showed off. I think they look cool. Um, and also, in the they did a... Where is the live stream? Here we go. Hi, everyone. It's... Okay. Uh, other things. Th I watched this live stream uh, live yesterday. I don't know. They picked the, like, most monotone, like... I don't This is probably the developer, the main developer or something. Damn, is this guy bad at explaining his game? Like, it's he's so monotone, and like everything he explains, he talks like one mile an hour, like one like one word per minute, you know. And I can have only one basic and one signature, but up to three. Okay. Um, and he showed off some things that really made me very upset. First of all, and this is gonna upset a lot of you, this game is no longer a rogue like; it's now a rogue light. And I don't know how to like express how like sad this makes me <sighs> there's gonna be permanent upgrades in wizard of legend 2 in the in like in the terms of um like you buy a spell or like you buy something from the shop and you just get extra health and you just get more gold and i'm like fuck i don't like roguelites they're so much less fun than roguelikes and wizard of legend one was so perfect and so fucking awesome and this makes me sad. But it's not all bad. It is not all bad. He did show off some things that were cool. Uh, like if you, I don't know where it was in this stream. Uh, ah, yeah, like this thing. This is fucking cool. So like the, if you like, if you, um, whatchamacallit, if you like freeze an enemy, then you can like, hit them with a different so like if enemies have like a certain elemental effect on them you can hit them with a different kind of magic and it, it like changes the effect which was not in the first game and that sounds cool because you can like mix and match spells together whatever i think that's cool the game's still in development but they're worrying me they are worrying me uh let's see if there's like a f if i can find a, an area of him doing combat this like quality is terrible too late That yeah, looks. I mean, that looks all right. Again, this is all very like early access as well. Oh, like, bullshit. So, I so I think, I don't know. I'm still holding out hope, but yeah, there's meta progression that makes me very, very upset. I don't like meta progression. I find it so boring. Um. Anyways, <clears throat> anyways, I think we are now ready. To perhaps... Oh, yeah, I also found this, this this thing. I wanted to show you guys. I found this um, 
a while ago. <laughs> but I've been listening to this all fucking day. Check out this this video I found. This is a Japanese... Uh, thank you for the $2. Can you react to the anima songs of the Abyss? Is this the fucking same guy coming in here from last stream? Talking about this... This guy... I watched the fucking trailer last stream, bro. Ugh. Check this out. This is some of my music that I listen to you pretty regularly. I just thought I'd share it with you guys. So that's what uh, Japan was like, basically. This is what uh, going out outside was like in Japan. Anyways! I think it's time, boys. I think it's time to spin the Wheel of Fortune. Are we ready? Our first roguelike game will be... Risk of Raid 2! It's over for you fuckers, I win instantly. It's over. <coughs> Risk of Rain 2 is a game that I have that is crashing currently. It is a game that is crashing currently. Hello? Okay. Okay, cool. All right. Sweet. Crisis averted. Crisis averted. We demand a re-roll. It's rigged. You demand a re-roll. Oh, also, uh, you might see in the corner resets remaining. Two. I've decided for this. This is the second time I've done this. So, a lot of these games are... You know, with every roguelike, there's, a bit, there's an element of, of luck. I am giving myself, over the course of the entire challenge... Two chances to like to to just reset and re-go if I have bad luck. You guys wanna fucking re-roll? I'm not putting on eclipse mode. I'm not doing that. Monsoon, bandit, or rigged. Oh my god. What if I use what if I do captain on uh, on regular? What are your thoughts on that? I don't even have this thing. I don't even I don't have the uh fuck. I guess I could do monsoon. Okay, here's our options. Here's our options, boys. Here's our options. I'm gonna let you guys pick. Either I play this on Monsoon to give it an extra challenge, or I reroll. Those are, those are your options. Monsoon or reroll. Go for it, boys. You guys think I'm- you guys- you guys really don't- you have that little faith in me? You think I'm- you- you think this is my fucking first rodeo? I think I should've taken the reroll. You should've taken the reroll. Oh, you poor, poor souls. I wrong. Monsoon it is. Monsoon it is. There we go. Um, uh, but I am picking Captain. I am, you can't, you can't, uh, convince me out of that one. I'm picking Captain, and I'm doing, um, I'm doing double hacking beacon. You can't stop me. So what is, what is Monsoon? I just have less regenerate, less, ah, oh, fuck, the 50% 50 difficulty scaling. That fucking sucks. Okay. I'm not doing fucking Elantris. Are you out of your mind? we have here so what kind of shit all right so if anyone in the chat has not played risk of rain 2 before um the gimmick with this game is that every second that you play the game um the difficulty gets harder so you want to like try to clear the levels as fast as humanly possible while, like you know grabbing some items and uh fuck i'm choking hard Dude, I'm like very worried now that I'm gonna like underperform in this game. I didn't I did practice this, but I didn't Okay, so the last time I've like I like genuinely grinded this game and like you know got good at it was about two years ago. And then to refresh my memory, I played one run. It's 
So, we'll see how this goes. Is there a shrine of chance anywhere? It's all these fucking printers. I found teleport already. Yeah, so you have, to <clears throat> you have to try to like clear the uh, the stages as fast as possible, and then do like a teleporter event. That's essentially the gimmick. Dude, I know there's like gonna be so many roguelike sweats in the chat, just like completely bashing on me and like making fun of me for like every misplay I make. I already feel like self-conscious. I feel like I'm just empathing terribly. Okay, that's not terrible. One minute cooldown. Okay. Any more items? Any more items? I haven't gone this way yet. Ooh. Um, okay. It's not bad. No, come back. Where my glasses go? Here we go. Um. Oh, I put it on the wrong side. Fuck, no, I don't want that. I wanted this one. I didn't see any strange chance. I'm just doing it here. I already know you guys are making fun of me. But I'm like trying not to look over too much. So this is the first one. This is the first one. Fuck. Okay. These are like all dog shit items. Whatever. I'm just going to go. I'm going to hit it. Excuse me, sir. How's the uh, audio levels, by the way? Is the music too loud? It feels loud. The music feels a little loud right now. Oh, music was good? Oh, okay. My bad. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> okay. Should I turn it back up? <laughs> oh, where's this fucker? Down. There was no. Sh there, oh, that's so slack. Damn man, the fucking item it gave me is terrible. There was no like shrine of the uh, shrine of the mountain or anything for me. Where is? Once nice. so I try to just teleport, I'll be able to go to the next stage. Uh, for the amount of loot that I got, five minutes was probably too long to spend here. But I don't think it's a big deal. 400 subs estrogen. We are not starting the estrogen comments again. Last time I did this stream, the chat would not shut the fuck up about estrogen. Me taking estrogen. It's not happening. But if it, if it does get me to that physique, though, you know what I'm saying? If it gets me the physique of those, uh, those boys that were singing about USA, perhaps. Perhaps estrogen is in the cards. What's that guy doing out there? Did you see the announcement about this game? I saw that there's a s sequel? Wait, no, what is going Yeah, there, there was a... What is going on with this game? Is it a new update? What is it? Can you get, get us the green timer in the corner? What does the green timer mean? Okay, well, wet lens. I don't like this one. Yo, come here. I need to murder you for coins. I'm so self-conscious. I know that I'm, I just, I might, fuck. Is my pathing terrible? Like, should I be like farming this chest or what? I just missed eight shots in a row. It's over.
in the fucking chest. Give me. I wonder if I should just hack it. I'm trying to save my hack for like something a bit bigger, you know? Using it. Killing an enemy permanently increases your maximum health up to 100. Yeah, it's okay. Cover here. Flat armor. I'll take the random. Chill out, bro. Um, I want to not spend as much time here, so I'm going to use that. I really want to shrine a chance. Okay, that was whatever, I guess. What's this guy up to? Yes, sir. Uh, so I have this. I equipped this hacking beacon on this character, which is very good. It gives me the chest for free. If I do it on a shrine of chance, I can get two items for free. <clears throat> That's good. That's a good find. That's actually an insane find. I fucking love the ukulele. It's like one of the best items. Best green items, at least. Dude, on my practice run as well, the practice run that I did, I had the most insane luck of all time. I was just getting like fucking red item after red item after red item. Kill these guys. Hello, almost got snuck up on. Farm this chest, found teleporter. All right, that's an okay item. I'll take it. Uh, teleport is this way. I think I will stay here for a little bit longer. You guys can fuck off. I want to go over to this side of the map more. We want two things in particular. We want movement speed and damage. Is really what we want the most of. And the other part of this, about this game that I, I'm worried about is that you tend to not really lose the, the run over time. Like, in some roguelike games, it's like... Uh, yeah, I don't know. Like, you take like a little bit of damage here, a little bit of damage there. And eventually, it like, kind of catches up with you. And you lose the run. And this one, it's more like... You think you're doing fine. You think you're doing okay. And then you get one shot out of nowhere. Um, or essentially one shot. Because there is a little bit of one shot protection. But it feels like you get one shot. You know what I'm saying? That's my main uh, fear right now, is that that's going to happen to me. But my chances of that happening are less and less the less time I shake. So I basically just got to stop um, wasting time. That sucks. Ooh, that's good. And I that, I think I'm out of here. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, this guy's a living, breathing human? Wow, I never comprehended this. How far is the fucking... <laughs> Shit! I should have been grinding this. There we go. At least I found it. Okay, that's okay. The feather's not bad. Take the feather. It's useful for Mithros. I'm out of here. Do you breathe air? I do on occasion. I think about it. This guy thought I was an actual bird PNG. But that's what happened. It happens. Ah, oh, fuck. I hate this one. Like what's going on right now? I guess I need to chill. Run, 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 run. Fuck! Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. You die, please. Please die. Okay. 
Okay. The RNG came in clutch there. I don't have any fucking healing, do I? We're fine. Now we're fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're fine. That was, uh, that was dumb of me for standing right there with that boss. I should have been hiding around this corner. I really should have been hiding around this corner. That was pretty stupid, but we're okay now. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. Okay, I was sweating, but all the, the doubters in chat just got proven wrong. I really should have, so that, you can just completely avoid that attack if you just stand, uh, not in this direct path. So I should have just been standing here. I'm stupid for that. I'm done. I forgot about that. All right. Shun the non-believers in chat. Shun all the non-believers in chat. Uh, there's a chest over there I might grab. What kind is it? What is that? Equipment barrel? Yeah, I'll grab it. Before I leave. I'll finish the teleporter event first, though. Yeah, I do. I do. I do know I can break the line of sight. I am aware. My bad. Where's your R ability? Oh, I used all of them. I get two of those um, beacons per per round. After that, it's gone. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, fuck. Wait, this is what an equipment is. I kind of like the equipment I have. Fuck, is the elephant good? I don't remember what it is. No, I think I like this better. Armor uh, Damage is better than armor, I think. I don't know if I'm going to regret that. Uh, the trailer you reacted to and the one I'm asking about are different. I'm talking about Songs of Abyss trailer on YouTube. You reacted to the Gate of Memories trailer on Steam Thoughts. I will react to it the end of this run, I promise you, because you gave me $10. And I will do anything for money. This is well known. Good night! Holy fuck! Six of this guy? Are you kidding me? And one of them's elite? Can you fuck off? Good night. This is Risk of Rain 2, indeed. Donation just went through. Reactive fan? No, I don't want that. No, I don't want that bullshit. Hello, chest? Anyone want to give me a chest? Anywhere. Please. There's an equipment chest down there. You guys can die for me. Please. Thank you. What is it that only spawning this robot? Is this a is this a feature? Am I missing something? This level is only spawning the robots. I'm not gonna complain about it. The uh, the fucking rams. I hate the rams on this map. They're so annoying. Is this a feature? What is going on? This is Risk of Rain 2 currently that we are playing, boys. Seems some confusion. Do I have to re- should I re-explain what we're doing? <laughs> Another feller. Okay. You guys fuck off me, please. Thank you. Uh, but... Wait, can I hack the, the 10 minute chest? There's a chest on this map that you can only open if you get here before 10 minutes. I wonder if I could hack it. That was, an, that was an okay Shrine of Chance. Hey, I've been wanting to learn Japanese for a while, but don't know where to start. Your advice gave you in your video was very helpful. Thank you. Thanks for the super, too. I don't know how much money you gave me, um, but thank you. I don't know how much, what a, what a CA is. Why is it only spawning robots? 
very confusing. I've never seen this happen before. Run teleporter. We need to get more chests first. It's not worth the hack, I think. It just gives a very and it's a big active item for an unlock. Oh, okay, I don't want that though. Okay, I got another one of these. I don't really want these. It's not very good. It's just not a very good ability that I want to be using a lot. So I could hack that chest, but I don't think I'm going to because someone in chat told me not to. I think I'll hack this. Oh, I can just open it. I have so much money. That's pretty good. This is run numero uno currently. Uh, thank you for joining the chat for your first time. Uh, first time still a J stream. Uh, they'd happen more often if I wasn't such a piece of shit. And we'd be able to catch more, maybe. Okay, what is going on with the chests? I'm not being trolled. I'm being trolled by the developers in real time. Uh, Shrine's Trance, that's huge. I'm actually very perplexed by the amount of robots that are spawning. That's good. One good one. Has anyone done the math on why there's only robots spawning? Has anyone done that yet? There's okay. Okay. Uh, is that a shrine of mountain? I'll take that. What is that? Shrine of order? I don't know what that is, and I'm not risking it. That's scary. <clears throat> uh, if you're up for playing a 2D roguelike on stream, that's amazing. You can play Revita. It's one of my favorite games. It's not very known. It has interesting mechanics. Revita. Okay. Uh, someone write that down. Someone write that down and remind me about it later. I'm about to do this right now. I'm busy. Currently gooning. Oh, what a surprise. Stone Titan. What a surprise. It spawned this guy. Oh, okay. Chill. Chill, 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 chill. Everybody, everybody, calm the fuck down. I got one down. We're fine. I don't know if someone has already explained to me why there's only monsters, the robots on this stage. Is this like a, just a random chance for this to happen? I'm getting fucking destroyed here. I'm getting fucking destroyed here. I gotta leave. I need to leave. We gotta dodge. We killed the monster, though. We killed the boss. That's huge. You guys can die. Thank you. Thank you. Good shit. Guys, I'm not liking my chances right now. I'm getting like it's kind of it's it's scary how uh, how often I'm getting led to low health. This doesn't usually happen. Like I said earlier, you, you usually just get one shot in this game. Like you have full health and you get one shot. So it, it's it's concerning me that I'm getting low health so much, so frequently. It's gonna be a monsoon. It's gonna be a monsoon for my first run back. That was just messed up for you guys. That was messed up for you guys to make me do that. We're down here. We're down here. It's easy to hack your 3DS. Did you know that? I think I did hack my 3DS at one point. No, I hacked my Wii. I had the homebrew channel on my Wii when I was a kid. Thank you for the uh, the five bucks, Fist Judge, by the way. Siren's Call. Uh, I would have rather had the red area. This is my, uh, my friend Owen, who I play this game with. He fucking hates this enemy. It's like his arch nemesis. The Elder Lumarian. He hates that enemy with like a passion, dude. It's very funny. This fucker. I think he complains about it like literally at least one time every time we play this game. He complains about that Elder Lumarian. This is getting a lot for me to handle. This is becoming a lot of uh, a lot of enemies at once. 
Can't lie. Oh, and one of these guys, too. That's perfect. That's swell. That's real swell. That's just cool. Did you add him in there? Thank you for that. Everybody fuck off. Everybody chill out. Fuck, I got frozen. Not good. Not good. Uh, chests. Here we go. What is going on? The thing is, I usually... When I play with my friend, we usually play Monsoon. When I play solo, I'm a pussy, and I usually play solo. Or, uh, regular difficulty. So this is, like... Just a bit overwhelming for me. Can this guy die, please? You stop moving, please. And maybe die also. Consider dying. Sure. Break the line of sight. Break the line of sight. Break the line of sight. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You're fine. You're fine. Just break the line of sight. We're fine. Okay. Cool. Got that guy dead. Now I have infinite money. Open all the chests. That's okay. Is an okay. I got two of them. Great. We didn't really want two of those, but it's it's fine, I guess. No more chests up here. Are we done? Are we done? Okay, I'm leaving. Game decided to uh, chill out for me for a second. It looks like. Should probably have checked up top first. That's pretty good. That's a very good weapon, actually. Your item. Lucky we got that. Good shit. Uh, teleporter's there. I'll just double check up here real quick. What is that thing over there? <clears throat> what is that shrine? What does that do? I have infinite money. Repair that thing. I don't even care. What on earth does this do? Somebody in chat, let me know what the Shrine of the Woods does. Somebody in chat. It heals me? Can I speak a little louder? Is that sar sarcasm or do I actually need to be louder? Healing. Okay, everyone is saying healing. You guys are not lying to me, right? No one is lying currently, yes? Holy shit, look at all these fuckers. No, I'm gonna kill them all in one go. That was actually really satisfying. Do I turn down my mic a bit? I can turn my, my mic down. Healing zone, no need to speak louder. Okay, I'm activating the healing zone thing. That sounds like it's good. I did, okay. <laughs> I thought it would be like, I thought it would like follow me or something. Apparently not. Is it gonna be the eye thing? The big eye? Yeah. Okay, that went pretty well. I was a little bit worried, but that went, that went pretty well, I think. I'd say that, that actually went off much better than I anticipated. <laughs> Holy damage is right. Jesus. I should think I missed one shotgun. One pellet from my shotgun spread missed there. So, you know, I could have been better. Fuck! I'm frozen. How many levels of run? It's, uh, if I'm not mistaken, it's one more and then the boss. One more than the final boss's level. If I'm lucky, I might get the, uh, the equipment that lets me skip the last level. But we'll see. 
<clears throat> Wait, guys, what if I beat this challenge on literally the first run? What, what do we do then? What happens if I just beat... Like, we did one roll, and what happens if I just beat... Uh, Risk of Rain 2? Well, I don't know what we're gonna do then. Let's well, we just keep going. Okay, so that ended. I'm gonna check this chest over here. It's not a chest, it's a fucking drone. Isn't there one over here? What is this? Fuck, they're drones. God damn it. Probably should just ping them to check. Alright, let's get out of here. You play Stanley Parable? I have played Stanley Parable in the past. It's a fun game. <gasps> Ooh. I don't know what that was, but it was shiny. Someone else has re recommended Revita as well. The second person to recommend Revita. Go away, mi missiles. Where would they go? Salute them, chat. Salute them. Doing God's work, those missiles. God's work of being absolutely... Fucking useless, those misses are terrible items. What do we got? Oh, I don't know what any of these do! I don't know what any of these do! Oh, wait, wait! Volcanic Egg, can't you get to the... You can skip the final boss if you do that, right? Fuck, I don't remember. I don't remember any of this. Keep the one you have? I'm hearing keep the one you have. Get the bug, they're meh. Okay, I think the one that I have is pretty good for the damage, you know? I need damage. <clears throat> no chest over this way as well. Okay, let's go down here and then we'll go up that way. Let's see. Hello. Hello, sir. What are you up to? <laughs> what is he up to over there? He's just chilling. Fuck it, let him live. Oh, hello. How do you do it, fine, sir? I'm dying. I'm dying. Please stop. Not great. Not great. Scam! Literal scam! What is that beam for if it doesn't even take you over? What? I know that on this level, you're, like, supposed to fully loot it. Ooh, I know what that does. Ooh, do I have time for this? Fuck it, I have time. We'll do it. Uh, the quail's healing, right? I think I need healing. Nope. That's not what that what is at all. I know what this thing does, though. We're going to the bonus stage. I'm gonna get a friend... Did I die over there? We're going to the bonus stage. I'm pretty sure time the timer stops when you go to the bonus stage, right? Am I wrong? It takes me to the bonus. What are you guys talking about? Loops? It doesn't loop you. It takes you to the bonus stage. Chat, do you guys not know how this game works? That takes you to the bonus stage. Ooh, uh, healing pass full grants you a temporary barrier layer. <laughs> well, that's never gonna happen. Uh... Hey, can you stop throwing stuff at me, please? What do we got? A faster sprint is okay. And chance to stun on hit. Ok, 
Alright, I should go over to this guy and kill him. Probably give me some money. I was not trying to chance here. I'm gonna go hit this a couple times. Gambling. We gamble, we love to gamble, we love gambling. Wow. Gambling ruined my life. Calm down for a sec, bud. I have a feeling those don't work in this guy. What is he about to do? What is he about to do? Oh my god, he's summoning the sun! What? Well, that was the uh, risk of rain, boys. <laughs> what is that move? He just summons the sun? Average risk of rain run. Very true. <clears throat> I was even like, I was killing him too. He was fine, but then he just fucking... <laughs> Population you. Welcome to Deadsville. Population you. Holy shit. Unmatched power. The sun bro nuked me. I said, remember that grandfather boss can make a zone of extreme damage near insta-kill. Oh, okay. I didn't read that message. How much should I repeat of that? All right. And with that, boys. We back to gambling. We return to the wheel. The wheel is God. Welcome back. I'm going to take some of my gamer subs. Coach Stellar, please send me money. And our next game is Inscription. Let's go. Uh, Casey's mod, of course. <clears throat> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh, the reason Wizard of Legend is on the wheels is because I played this game. I did this challenge once before, and I, be I beat it during using Wizard of Legend. Why does this keep happening? Why does this keep happening? Wait, before we do this, there was another game that someone told me to look up. What was it called? Somebody, was, You guys were supposed to write it down. Someone was supposed to write it down. Uh, was it Revita? That's what it was. Revita. Watch trailer. Ooh. Heart sacrificing story. I got a dragon claw. We'll do it. We'll do it right now. An amnesiac child. Okay. This game looks interesting, but here's my holdup. We haven't seen the unmatched power of the sun yet, so can it really be that good? I haven't seen him wielding the unmatched power of the sun quite yet. Gungeon art style? It's pixel art. Not every game that has pixel art is Gungeon art style, bro. Okay, you can Goomba stomp people. This was cool. I got Dragon Call. We're gonna we're gonna watch it in one second here. I got you, bro. Guys, what was the name of the game that Dragon Claw wanted me to fucking react to? I forgot it already. Okay, this looks cool. How much is it? Ten dollars? That's a little hefty. That's a little hefty. Hang on. Ten dollars is is interesting, but counter offer uh counter offer G2A. How much is it on G2A? Do a little bit of uh, stealing it. Revita. One dollar. I'll give you one dollar for this game. I'll give you one dollar for Revita. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking, bro. That is what I am talking about. That's what I like to see, baby. You save a couple of money. We save a little bit of money this way. This is not pirating, guys. No, 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 no. We're not pirating. We're not pirating. We're not pirating, guys. We're not doing that. We're not pirating anything, guys. We don't. We don't do. 
We don't. We no, 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 no. We don't steal. We don't steal here. We don't. We don't commit crimes here. That's gonna get me banned. That's gonna get me banned. That's gonna get me banned from YouTube. We don't do that here. We we borrow. We borrow games here. We borrow, guys. We borrow. We borrow. We borrow. We borrow. We borrow. We, borrow, we, borrow. we do some borrowing. Yeah, our video looks cool. It literally looks cool. Um, songs from the abyss. The other one that I have to look at. Songs from the. I need my song from the abyss. I'm not gonna fucking. I'm not gonna do a key from an indie developer, guys. Chill. We're not. We're not doing that. <laughs> it's okay, guys. We're not. We're okay. I'm not. I'm not that. I'm not gonna sink that low. Now, if it was okay, my my exception to this rule. I will use this for indie games if it's one of those, if it's like a party game that I have to buy like five Steam keys for my friends. That's the, that like, uh, like when I bought everyone like speedrunners. Yeah. Yeah, I had to buy this for like five of my friends for a video last year. And I'm like, it's like $20 on Steam. I'm not paying that much. I'm sorry. Uh, and then also for, for AAA games every day, every time. I always, I always check you to it first. Are you kidding me? Okay. All right, let's watch the anime game. I was paid ten dollars to watch this trailer. Okay. She looks potential. Ooh, he's hot. I was gonna say that one lady playing the piano was hot, but fuck, look at that guy. You know what he? I mean, you know what he's packing. You know, you ever heard of a this thing called a dragon dildo chat? He's the model. He's the model. I'm telling you right now. Mm. Can they put an end to this, this hairstyle boys am i wrong boy all my fellas in the chat all my fellas this hairstyle magnifique that's my thing ba -bum -bum -bum. this is cool i mean it's i mean it's look at deep woken okay i'll do that in a sec Six side. Do I play as her? Do I play as the other guy? Always oh, got the Genshin switch out thing. Okay. <gasps> Dragon Daddy, it's him. He's in the flesh. Thing. What the? That looks interesting. I mean. Oh, this is coming soon. This isn't even out yet. Um, is it an RPG? I just. I'm not super into RPGs. That's like my. Oh, fuck. What have I just done? Oh, everything on my monitor just fucking minimized because I did that. Oh, no, 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 no. Did I just don't know also don't know someone by the way? Did someone send me uh did somebody send me something to, to check out something? Fuck, what was the name? There's another game I was supposed to look at. Deep Woken, that's what it is. I remember. Okay, 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 okay. Fuck, I have to like reopen all my tabs. They all just minimize themselves. What is going on over here? Uh okay, Deep Woken. And then we're there, Okay, this is the last one. This is the last one. It's not on Steam. Uh Deep Woken. Scam. I got scammed. <clears throat> this is the last one I'm looking at, and then we gotta go back to the to playing these video games. What is your wallpaper? I think it's just it's just some koi fish swimming around. Hang on, I'll change it. Sorry. That was a little I'm sorry. Here I, I that's I, that's a little bit obscene. I'll change it to something better. There we go. I'm sorry guys. That was you're right. I shouldn't have done that and I apologize. I'd like to issue a public apology. Now that I fixed it, we should all be good. Um Okay, uh, deep, deep, deep Woken is a Roblox game. Deep Woken is a a Roblox game. I'm not, guys. Do you hear Roblox? I'll humor you, and it's in Japanese. I apologize. How do I store server? 
I apologize. You have to take a look into my my hideous, fucked up life. What is this? I don't care. Fucking great. Now fandom knows that I'm an adult. Awesome. Okay, here's a Deep Woken. Is there a trailer for it, maybe? Deep Woken trailer. <clears throat> okay, here we go, boys. Guys, this is like shit. What is this? What is this? Is this copyrighted song, by the way? Yeah, we can check. It's not. This looks like terrible. I'm not even gonna lie to you. <laughs> this looks so bad. What is this fucking? You just cropped the bottom of it out to make it look like a film cinematic. What is the editing? He's got like all the fucking. I can't even tell what's going on. It's so blurry. <laughs> Wait, is he? Shh. There's someone talking. There's somebody talking over that. He just stole someone's fucking Let's Play footage. <laughs> oh, my oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. In hindsight, yeah, it's probably the one with 128,000 views and not the one with 3.3 thousand views. <laughs> Okay, my in hindsight, that's my bad. In hindsight, that's probably my bad. <laughs> okay, this is sorry. I have gamer brain. Sorry, I have to, I have to fucking. The irony of like trying to make it look like all awesome and it's firing and it's like the Lego characters is the fuck. <laughs> wow, he's so cool. Yo, this is so epic. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I'm not playing that game ever in my entire life. I'm sorry, but there's absolutely zero chance of me playing that game. Okay, I'm not putting any modifiers on this, by the way. Uh, we're just going to play good old fashioned, good old fashioned uh, inscription. If you guys are just tuning into the stream, we lost our first round. We lost our first uh, game of. of um, we just play Risk of Rain 2. Um, I have to keep playing roguelikes until I beat one. If I lose, I switch roguelikes. We're on game number two. This is Inscription. This is uh, a really good game. I fucking love Inscription. Uh, but this is like the uh, the roguelike version of the game. <clears throat> so I don't think I... I don't think I... Can you cheat in this one? Okay, so he's going to give me some free cards here to start out with. Beaver. Card bring this is just play damage creation. Okay. It's not bad. Can I sacrifice the damn, I wonder? Um So the way this is a, a card game where you have to sacrifice like creatures, like kill them off to play other ones. I think a mantis would be good. The great light is a little bit enticing. The issue is that it's cost cost three to play that. Which is a little bit expensive. I need to keep my, my costs down. Uh, I might take the Mantis plus Great White, honestly. Is it hard? It's... I haven't beaten it in a while. <laughs> I beat it a couple of times, and then I haven't beaten this mode. I'll take the Great White, I guess. It's good to have one damage card. <clears throat> um, I... Next game should be the original Rogue. Ooh, I could do that. You can play. I'm pretty sure you can play the original Rogue. Play R-O-G-U-E online free. I need a virus. I'm seconds away from getting a virus. Press any key to continue. Launching emulator. Rogue's name. J. Yeah, you can play the original Rogue. If you guys uh, don't know, roguelikes come is a genre um, created from this game. This is the original game. That could be fun. We could do that maybe, like maybe, 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 perhaps, 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 perhaps. I'll put, I'll add it to the list. How about that? I'll add it to the list. Okay, do I wanna? What do I have? Uh, I could sacrifice. No, I don't want that. I'll go here. <clears throat> 
A decrepit woodcarver appeared before you. She moved with a certain vigor in spite of her considerable age. Is the volume good, by the way, guys? Can I turn it up? It, seems, it feels quiet. Um, I want the wolf head. Goodbye, woodcarver. I don't want to... Uh, I guess I could add review to the wheel, but... Ugh. Maybe. We'll think about it. What do we got? Pronghorn coming in. Um, let's see. I could play the squirrel and then get the bullfrog out to block... That'll work. Oh, wait, but he doesn't attack in front of himself. I just realized that. Okay, whatever. That's unfortunate. It took two damage. So, essentially what I have to do, I have life. This little, like, uh, hang on, let me draw a card. I want to draw the squirrel. Uh, so, how this game works is, like you saw, there, there was the map earlier. Um, I don't know if I can pull it up right now. I don't think it lets me. Um... I go, I basically, I progress to the map. It's like, very similar to Slay Aspire. Uh, and I have each of these games. We have to try to tip the scale, the damage scale, all the way to the end, and then I win. Um, and if he tips it all the way my way, I lose a life. You really don't want to lose your lives. It's very bad. Because um, then you lose the game. And also, I can do this. Oh, wait, I can't do it right now. I have to, I have to beat this. Uh, so, yeah, essentially, each card has, like, this little, uh, the amount of blood that it costs to play. Um, and so I can play um, a card. Like, a squirrel, this one's free, for example. And then I have to murder it to play the card that I want to play. <clears throat> so I'm going to kill all three of these uh, and place my great white. Kill him. And now we're chilling. This is like the first um, combat of the game, so it should go pretty quickly. Um, and I'm going to try to do as much damage as humanly possible here. Because if any damage that you go, anytime like you go over, you get to keep the extra damage that you deal and turns into money. Little teeth there. How this game works is you get Ouroboros and break it. I've never... Is Ouroboros that good? Like, I haven't, like... I really haven't thought about it. I, I practiced this twice last night. Um... And I got Ouroboros, or like, I had the chance to take Ouroboros, but I didn't. I didn't think it was that good. Um, okay, I could get a new card or I could get... I think this is probably better. Infinite Squirrel Strats. Be darned. You came across me early. Care for a chance? Give me a chance. Pick a bowler. Break into gold. If, if there's gold in there, it's mine. I choose you. Damn it. Not, not gold. Oh, well. All mine, though. Have you guys... Is anyone in the chat, like... There's a couple of you, obviously, um, that have played this game. But if you haven't, you really should. This is, like, one of my favorite games that I've played. Like, the original story. Like, not the roguelike a aspect of it. Because this is just, like, the <clears throat> the roguelike. Like, after you beat the main game, you unlock the roguelike. The, this version that I'm playing now. But the original game is really good. <clears throat> the story is, like, insanely, insanely good. I think Matt had did a video on it. Uh, okay, what do I want? I go for the Elite here. Um... I think I'll go this way because I kind of have a lot of money. Do I have anything I want to sacrifice? I could sack the mantis and put it on the wolf. Or I could sack the... No, that wouldn't be good. Um... Does a B cost any money to play, or is a B free? I don't know. I might take... You can't beat it? This game, that's not that hard. These are free? That sounds pretty good, then. Well, here's my thought. What if I put the... What if I sack uh, the bullfrog and put the bee, the beehive shit on there? Because currently, this beehive is not very good. Because... This can literally never get struck because it has the submerge thing. So I'm thinking sack the beehive, put it on bullfrog. That sounds like a good idea to me. I'm not waiting for anyone. I'm not waiting for anyone in chat. You can't sacrifice things with blue sigils. Fuck. Which so that beehive is literally useless then. That beehive is literally completely useless. Shit. Okay, well what am I sacking then? Um, ooh, what if I sacked Mantis and then put it on Great White? Because then the Great White will do 8 damage. That's pretty good, I think. 
That sounds very good to me. Yo, Jay, where do you live? I baked cookies for you and me. Um, hmm. 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 Mantis is, pow is a powerful... Mantis to a powerful creature. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, I'm sacking Mantis. Goodbye, Mantis. Putting on Great White. This might be a huge misplay. Wait, I'm stupid. I should have done the opposite of that. <laughs> I should have done the- I should have fucking- Ah! I should have sacked the Great White. Because he costs more. I'm stupid. Whatever. Actually, no. I'm just going to roll with that and pretend that it was a very smart decision. Uh, Porcupine, Coyote. Uh, I'll put the Bullfrog down to block the... Huh. This beehive is so terrible. I'm so pissed that I got this. I could put the Bullfrog down to block the Coyote. But then he's going to die, and then I'm going to be in a shitty situation. Maybe squirrel to... Or just wait. Or what if I just wait, take the three damage, and then I can put the wolf down next turn and kill the coyote. I'm doing that. Boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Kill coyote. Um, and then I'm going to taking one, two damage, which will kill me. I need a squirrel. Boom, boom, and block the porcupine, I guess. It doesn't really matter. Put the bullfrog in the middle. I've never played this game <laughs> Well, that was actually, coincidentally, the correct play. So, <clears throat> you're doing great. <clears throat> you're doing great, sweetie. That, that beehive is so bad. God, I need to get rid of that. You have me. I surrender. Okay. Wait, but if, if he doesn't surrender, if I keep playing, then I can get money. So, why would I do that? That's a terrible idea. I'm not going to surrender. If I do this and I beat him by more, if I beat him by like a certain amount of money, then I've, I'll just get money. I'm not going to surrender. That's a terrible idea. So watch this. Play this. Sack all three of these. One, two, three. Place the great white. Now I, look all this money I get. Imagine if I surrendered. What's your favorite roguelite rogue light game? I really don't like roguelites that much. Okay, uh, I can buy pelts, which honestly is pretty good. Um, I could get another item this way, and I could upgrade a card this way. I think that's a pretty good idea. I have money. I have money to buy pelts. I'm doing it. On the house, I can take the rabbit pelt. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Give me the golden pill. Thank you very much. This is a rogue light, though. Not really. How is it a rogue light? Not the not the Casey's mod. Okay, I'll enhance the health of. I think I could enhance the health of the bullfrog and just like have a good blocking card. Cause this guy's never gonna die. I'm doing that. Epic blocking card. Am I gonna risk it? Uh, leave it to chat. Leave it to chat. So if I there's a I don't know what the actual odds are, but there is a chance if I put it in there that I lose the card. Risk it. Don't leave it to chat. Leave it to chat. You guys got that. Here, give you guys something to look at while you while you decide. You guys, oh, I know you guys like that. <whistles> you fucking degenerates. Okay, it's overwhelmingly people are telling me to, to risk it. Okay. If I lose this, I lose the card. You guys know that, right? 
You guys wouldn't. You guys wouldn't sacrifice it. You guys wouldn't sacrifice me. There you go. Terrible day. Terrible fortune. All your fault. All your fault. What are the odds on that? Does anyone know? Uh, ninety-nine percent of gamblers quit. Uh, does anyone know what the actual odds are there on that? Like the the number. Uh, okay. I'm gonna. I got all my like. This sucks. This is a terrible starting hand. Um. This really sucks. Um. Squirrel to beehive. I get that does nothing for me. That's so useless to me. Um. First time catching a stream. Love your content. Thank you, Blocks, for the two dollars. I love you. Unless you're a child, then um, I respectfully appreciate your donation. Why did I just play that? That was a fucking terrible idea. Okay. Well, I. This means nothing. I mean, fuck. I can get this card out of my hand, I guess, if I do this. Sweet. I was kind of—I was not really paying attention. <clears throat> okay. I need a squirrel. Um, and then I'm gonna try to kill this pronghorn because he's an issue for me right now. I forget what the difference between rogue light and rogue light. Is so I simply use rogue light for both drones because I'm simply used to saying that. So a rogue like is a game um, where if you lose the game, you start completely over. With some, I mean, I don't know. It, the the consensus is kind of you know out there on what the definition is, but if there's a little bit of help, then it's generally still considered like a little bit of upgrades. Like enter the gungeon. I think most people would consider that a rogue uh, a rogue like, even though technically. You do eventually unlock um, more like upgrades and shit. Um, but it basically, if it's very middle, like uh, killing, like dying, essentially restarts you, like basically completely. That's a rogue like. If it's a rogue light, it means it's a game that um, you like keep your progress. Okay, so this will do one, two, three, four. So I'll go here. And then. Too much squirrel. I'm just trying to get maximum damage out of this guy for extra money. Rogue Light is like, it, it, ha it helps you. It gives you like free shit to win. Like after the, after the, like, I like Hades, a Rogue Light. Um. Sacrifice everything and play Beehive. You're an insane man. Cockroach, Raven, Skunk. Cockroach, maybe? Perhaps? No, I, I think a rogue, Isaac would be a roguelike. It's closer. Hades is a roguelite. Um, Dead Cells is a roguelite. Are you playing with a mod that removes the extra story stuff? No, this is the, this is what you unlock after the game. Don't get cockroach. I'm think yeah, I'm thinking skunk maybe. Just because it's a low power card. Any more low power cards or low um cost. It, Raven seems good though. Reroll. I don't think you can reroll these. I haven't really played much Isaac. I think I have like 30 minutes in in rogue ro in uh in uh Isaac. I'm gonna go with. Fuck, it doesn't do any damage, though. This is just a blocking card. The Clover re-rolls? Are you guys lying? Oh, you weren't. <gasps> what the fuck is that thing? What is that? I really want Black Goat. I know Black Goat's good as fuck. What is this, though? Hello? Dude, Black Goat's good though. Like I know, like I know for a fact that Black Goat is good. What is this thing? I know, but take. I don't know, but take it. Everyone's saying take it. I don't think any of you guys have played this game before. I don't know. I think it's the weird mirror thing. This is that is lore. You play with what? Uh... 
Don't go for its mid. I'm going for Black Goat, I think. Pull the ticket. Last time I did a poll, you guys killed my, my frog. My frog is dead because of my last poll. I don't know if I trust the polls anymore. Let me take that out of context. Let me take that out of context. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get accused of some, some political shit. <laughs> Stop the count! Stop the count! Fuck. It looks cool though, but Black Goat is good. It turns into a random card. I think I believe that. I think I believe that it turns into a random card. I think I just want Black Goat. L. L chat. You guys got ignored. You guys all got Dono walled. Thoughts? Okay, um, I should go this path because I don't have a sigil right now. Yeah, I don't have a sigil. I don't really have anything I want to sacrifice. <clears throat> I'd love to sacrifice his beehive. I'd love to kill that beehive and never see it again. I need a sigil. A woodcarver. Um, ooh! Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. Pleasure doing business with you. So that symbol lets me my creatures attack twice, all my wolf creatures. So I don't really have any I don't really have any wolf creatures. Uh what do I have? I have one wolf. Okay, that's not even that good. <laughs> I literally have one wolf and that's it. Um I guess I got the bird head as well. I don't have any birds either though. Or do I have snakes? I have like no, these are useful to me. I'll take the bird head, whatever. The birds are typically good in this game. Uh, but I'm definitely taking the, the wolf plus <clears throat> that thing. N Isaac is 97% locked content. You have to do like 10 hours before you get everything. But like, even once you unlock the content, does like, does it make you better? Like if you unlock something, does it make you better at the game? Cause that's what like, you know, that's what like uh, Hades does. Like if you, you play the game and then you, after each run, you just get better. Like the game does it for free. Okay. Okay, I just won. <laughs> I just was a fucking incredibly good open hand. Wow. This is such a good open again. Okay, smoke plus squirrel. Smoke plus squirrel. Uh, play the wolf. Wait, no, 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 no. Smoke. Uh, smoke, black goat, great white. This counts for three, right? Yeah. Smoke, goat, uh, great white. Game's over. And I'm gonna hold on to these because I know that it's gonna. Oh, I should have placed it one over. What am I doing? Whatever. Yeah, because he's gonna take that. Um, so I should. Take the squirrel and then place the wolf. That's gonna do six damage to him. I think I just win right there. I think I just won. Wow. Literally perfect game. <laughs> what a good opening end. That guy did nothing to me. Okay, I'm gonna open up the forum uh, for which one of these I should take though, because I don't really know. Man, whoa, Mantis God. It's Mantis God, right, guys? It's Mantis God. It's Mantis God, right? This is such a good card. Risk of Rain 2 win. We just did Risk of Rain. I just lost Risk of Rain, but we're going to roll the dice, the, the wheel again. Dude. <laughs> the run's over. You guys already lost. We might even eat. Rat? You guys are saying rat? You're crazy. You're crazy for that. What does that symbol do? We're in the ice biome now. What does this thing do? What is that? I don't know what that card, what that is. And then I, okay, what else is down this path? Oh, I could duplicate a card if I go this way. What does the cave do, fellas? What does the cave do? The trial sells for, se I can, can I sell, is that real? Can I sell my first at this place? It's a trial? Challenge for a card. Okay, I don't think I want that. I think I just get the regular card and then I could sack Bro, imagine if I like, I sack. Eh, actually, I don't really have anything I think I want to sack. Cause Mantis God is, is good, but it has like low damage, but also low cost. I was thinking of sacking that and putting it on the wolf. But my wolf already gets from my sigil. My wolf already gets the double attack anyways. 
I don't really think I need that. I can't sack the beehive. It won't let me. Sack mantis, put it on wolf. That's what I thought, but then it's going to be extra money. And my wolf already gets that bonus. He already gets the double. Maybe I go... I'm just going to go here and hope that I got a card that's worth sacking. Warren, Magpie, Loose Buck. Hmm. Magpie is a good... ability, doesn't he? What does Warren do? This gives you the... Yeah, you get the rabbit. Reroll? What are our thoughts on this? Can you sack a pelt? I don't think you can do that. I think Warren's... I got Warren yesterday in my practice run. Go for Warren. Whatever. Okay. Okay, fuck. I should have let the... I should have let the, the... I should have let the fucking chat message... I saw one guy say Warren. And then everyone else said Magpie. No. <laughs> everyone else is saying reroll. I should have waited longer. No. No, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. <clears throat> um... Oh, these are pretty good, though. I don't think I want to sack the Mantis Cut. What would I put it on? What would I even put it on? I put on the Wolf? Does that stack? Because if I... If my Wolf gets the double attack as well. Would that be... that go both? Some of you guys are saying yes, some of you guys are saying no. Mantis Cut, Wolf. The Rat needs a sacrifice. Uh, I don't know if I want... Put Mantis to the wolf, please. Okay, fine. But it's going to cost more money, guys. Whatever. I'm doing it. Mantis God. Wolf. Do it. That is pretty good, though. That's three. That's a nine damage per hit on that wolf. Uh, great way. Okay, squirrel, black. That's a pretty good opening hand. That's a very good opening hand. I go squirrel, go play the great white. Uh, great white. Place him. Yeah. Game's over. Sweet. <laughs> that great white's actually been incredibly helpful. Uh, okay. What is this box thing? Also, I could duplicate one. Yo, imagine if I duplicate my my wolf. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Double wolf. Okay, this guy takes my pelts. Air pelts. Um, magpies or mantis is good. <sighs> mantis or magpie? I'm thinking. I also I could take a. A bat, because I don't, I don't have any cards that capitalize off of bones. The coyote slash bat. I think mantis, though. Yeah. Golden pill. Ooh, child 13 is good. Another mantis god! Double mantis god! Or also, Gek is, is also okay if you can upgrade him, but I don't think I'm gonna upgrade. Ooh, shh. Mantis god twice? I'm thinking mantis god twice. It's that or Child 13, because the, the infinite... Uh, infinite, like, sacrifices is very useful. I'm going for Mantis God, though. No question. Dude, I'm okay, now I need the campfire. I need the campfire so bad now. Okay. I got you. Okay, what am I duplicating? I'm thinking I'm duplicating the wolf. Right? He uh he sometimes he gets like the um whatchamacallit wrong though. He might give it like a different um uh different like attack amount. Okay, he gave it less less health. That's fine. That's kinda broken. That's extremely broken. Uh what I get? Beehive, terrible card, terrible, terrible cards. I think I go squirrel. Uh hang on, do squirrel wearing and then use the, the bunny to do the mantis. 
Squirrel Warren to block this guy. Use the rabbit to play the mantis. Put it there. Sounds good to me. Um, and now I need a squirrel, don't I? I need a squirrel. Um, he'll do damage to both of those guys. Not a whole lot, though. But the beehive to do nothing. The beehive could block damage. Yeah, I'll put the beehive to, to block. Oh, wait, the beehive. I forgot the beehive is a block. It's just whatever. It doesn't matter. I can just sack it next round. Game's over. GG. Oh, wait, this stupid guy. Oh, my mantis is gonna die. No. Uh. Great white. Six. Okay. I think the. No, because it's a flying guy. He doesn't hit my guy. One, two, three. Two. The run's over already. Oh, wait. I just die. Okay. We're chilling. I definitely need. One of these. Um. Yikers. This is not good. One, two, three. So that elk will die. I'll take two from that. I'm gonna take three damage this turn. That's okay. No, I'll take four damage. That's fine. One, two, three. Cutting close. Cutting it kind of close. Um, I should get a squirrel, sack the mantis god, and the squirrel for the wolf. Uh, place it here to kill all three of them, right? Yeah. Dude, it does do twice! That's so broken! Dude! Okay. Oh, if I had a squirrel, if I had a squirrel, I could get even more damage. I could get... Oh. One, two, three, four, five. Yo! That is so stupid broken. I could buy more pelts now. Do I have anything to sack? Uh, I could sack the... The game's broken. I don't think I want to sack it. I could get a pack, uh, pack rat. I'm gonna go buy more pelts. I have so much money. Look how much money! One of those. Uh, I might as well just get a bunch. Should I get three? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, I think is that enough? Fuck it. I have infinite money. We're good. Thank you very much, my friend. Well, I get the pack. It's either pack or sack something. I don't really want to sack any of these things. So should I get, start giving you thirty dollars a month again? Please don't. <laughs> um, what would I sack? I would sack. I guess I, could, I would sack the mantis god and put it on. No, nah, I don't even have anything to put it on. I would love to put it on something, but I have nothing to put it on. I could put on a great white, I guess, and get rid of. Is there? We have. He already has that. I just think I should save that mantis god for something more. Uh, I got, once I get a, a higher damage dealing card. What else would I sack then? I don't think I have anything to sack. I could sack the black goat and put it on a stoat, I guess. Just to get it a little bit more consistent. Or, or on the wear in, maybe? No, because I want the wear in for blocking. I gotta sack the black goat, put it on the stoat. Put mantis on mantis? God, does that stack? Oh my god, wait, that totally stacks.
But now he does. Now my mage is down just five damage. Okay, it's. I gotta get rid of these golden pilts. I gotta get rid of these. These are gonna be the death of me. I should have gotten three. I should have gotten just the two and been been done with it. You can play these, right? If they die, do they disappear? Do I not have them anymore? I think if they die, you lose them. I can't. I can't block anything with them right now, so it doesn't matter. I think I might lose this round, to be honest with you. I can sell these for very good cards. Fuck, that's a terrible draw. I might have to use one of like my hook or something. I could take his raven. Um, I definitely need a card to play. That's very good if I can get something to sack. I'll take two damage this round. And then I think that I'll live. Okay, so let me the squirrel down and then wolf definitely here to get rid of the thing that's dealing damage okay we're back in it <clears throat> incredible okay easy win i still get like six fucking coins i think i win i think i just won the game I think there's no chance of me losing this now. Ooh, black goat. Ooh, 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 ooh. But also pronghorn. Not black goat for sure. Yes! 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 Get the fuck out of here, you shit beehive. I never want to see you again. Thank God. Thank God for that. Well, Buckshot Roulette looks really different. Shut up. Dude, the developers of Buckshot Roulette gave me a key. They just emailed me like, hey, here's a free key. Heck yeah. Thank you, Becca. Nice clickbait with Hades too. Yeah, we do a little bit of clickbaiting. The Trapper. Oh my gosh. I'm so scared. Uh, my good Mantis God, and the game's over, I think. Doesn't that, like, kill my, my creature if I like, hit it or something? Whatever. Uh, I play Smoke, and then I play Mantis God, and now I win the game. Uh, hindsight, I probably should have placed that to the left, shouldn't I? I'm, I'm a little bit dumb for that. Squirrel, stoat. Okay, I'm gonna take one, two, three damage here. Yeah. Okay, uh, I can play the squirrel and the stoat and then just minimize the damage and get rid of one of these things. Oops. Okay. And I should save up for my great white. Did you catch the III stream? If so, thoughts. I caught, yeah. So I saw, uh, so this bar two got announced. That's good. Um, what else happened? So this bar two got announced, and also the Wizard of Legend thing. I went over that at the beginning of the stream. Went over the Wizard of Legend stuff. Oh, I forgot to even tell you guys. I went to Texas uh, on Monday. Okay, um, and I'm completely fucking stupid. I got distracted by talking, and I just misplayed the shit out of this. Fuck me. What am I doing? I got distracted. I literally just got distracted. And I just decided to place two squirrels down and a wolf pelt for no reason. Okay. That's... Oh, I, and I just lost. I didn't realize things were that dire. Oh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> My God, run. <laughs> no. <laughs> this
this is all okay. Where is it? Where the fuck is this guy? Where is he? Where is he? This fucker. This fucker right here blocks. It's his fault. It's all his fault. Everyone, bu everyone, everyone bully blocks. Ban this guy. Ban blocks. Where is he? Where is the fuck? Okay, put user in timeout. Yeah, yeah. Fucking okay, put him in timeout for five minutes. You. This is your fault. Your fault. His fault, not mine, not mine, not mine, not mine, not mine, not mine. It's not my fault. It's not, it's not my fault. It's not my fault, Chad. It was him. He did that to me. <sighs> so I went to Texas last week over the weekend. <sighs> I went to Texas over the weekend and I, uh, I don't know. I guess that's how the eclipse. I guess it was the coolest fucking thing I've ever seen in my entire life. <sighs> I guess that's how the eclipse. Yeah, I guess it was cool. That was where my story was going. <sighs> and I have pictures of it too, if you guys even care. If you guys even care about seeing pictures of the eclipse that I took in Texas. <sighs> there it is. How cool that is. These are raws. You can't see them. Ah, <sighs> this is a very blurry photo because I was freaking out because of how cool it was. This is what the sunset looked like. There it is again with a different lens on my camera. This music is too happy for me right now. I need something else. That's perfect. This reflects my mood. This reflects my mood perfectly. Yeah, okay. Nah, for real, the eclipse was the eclipse was pretty cool. The eclipse was pretty pretty awesome. I can't even lie. Yeah, so I was in. Hang on, I'll pull the map. I'll pull the map. Going down here, anyways, and we went to. So we started in San Antonio. We we went down to San Antonio, um, and. We woke up on San Antonio in the morning and on the morning of Monday when the eclipse was happening and saw nothing but absolute overcast skies. <laughs> so that was awesome. We're like, okay, I guess we're not gonna be able to see the eclipse. That sucks. This is like soul shattering to me. My dad was like, ah, whatever. I just came down to see my brother. Uh, my, I was like completely soul shattered. So I got, I said, dad, get in the car. It's like 5 a.m. So dad, get in the car. We're driving. Uh, we drove all the way to, we drove to Austin first. Austin's still completely overcast. Uh, then we drove up to Waco. Waco was a little bit better. But it was still like, we were like, okay, this is good. We, if we're at Waco, we can maybe see like parts of the eclipse. Um, uh, and then we, we waited around. We got, we got breakfast in Waco. And then the clouds just slowly started coming. They just slowly got closer and closer and closer. I was like, no, 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 stop. Um, and we made the decision with like an hour left that we needed to go further. So we drove up I-35 again, there's a little bit of traffic. We made it to Hillsboro. It was a lot better, but we just like parked on the side of the highway and the clouds started coming again. I was like, dad, it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. So we drove, I don't even know how to get there. I think it was this, I think it was this, this road. Yeah, we just drove up here. This is like the middle of nowhere farms. These are all farms in this entire area. And we just drove up this area until we found a place with, with no, um, clouds and we parked it and it was literally like just farms everywhere like no one else but there there but us and we got a place with no clouds and we saw it and it was the coolest thing i've ever seen in my life the eclipse was sick the eclipse was sick um uh yeah so there's that anyways back to the wheel Fuck. Wait, 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 wait. This doesn't count. 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 We forgot the music. We forgot the music, chat. I can't do it without the music. You guys don't get to see what it landed on. We need the music. Risk of rain. Wait, we already did Risk of Rain. No, we're not doing Risk of Rain again. Come on. Come on. It's got to be at least like three games until we get to do Risk of Rain again. Come on. Hades. Hades it is. 
Hades it is, boys. Hang on, wait, no, my, my wheel's on a different tab now. Welcome back, Blocks. Put Ravita on the wheel. I haven't played. I don't want to put Ravita on the wheel. I don't even have the game. I haven't played it before. We're doing Hades. We're doing Hades. We're doing Hades. Now, I haven't played Hades in a very long time. But it is a rogue light, so I think I have a bit of an advantage. I mentioned this before, but for people just joining the stream. Uh, Hades. What is this thing? Okay, here we go. So what's the My Step Bros a Femboy game asking for a friend? Um One sec. Sorry. Um Just give me one sec here. Yeah, so I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, so I have no idea what you're talking about. Um, that seems to be... I'm not entirely sure what that is. I forgot to exit this. Okay. Uh, yeah, anyways, Hades up next. Oh my god, that's loud. All right, boys. Uh, I have to pee real quick. Um, you guys keep thinking about whatever it was just that, that just happened. Uh, I got to pee real quick. I'll be right back in two seconds. And we'll play some Hades. Sound, like, sound good? Sound like a plan? Be right back. Love you. Don't go anywhere. Now, uh, you know, actually, and, and I'm just going to just to fuck with you guys. I'm going to do a little add-in. A little add for you guys. <laughs> I stay money. I keep money. You know, I keep my money up. Uh, all right. Um, I'll be right back.
And welcome back, boys. Welcome back, femboys, even. You're welcome here. All femboys allowed here. All of them. Totally okay with femboys. I'm totally... I'm totally... Just... <clears throat> Don't say anything about what? Shut up about Ravita. I'll play it, I swear. I swear. The plan? What's the plan? Fellas, what is the, uh... What is this plan you're talking about, huh? Uh, I'd love to know what this plan that you kids keep, uh, keep talking about is. I would love to know. Okay, also, so, so because, this is, because it's a roguelite, first of all, I haven't played it in a while. That's the, that's the first stipulation for, like, for allowing me to play a roguelite. Number two... I will play with a weapon that I don't usually use. I usually use, uh, where is it? The spear. That's what I like pretty much always use. Um, because I'm feeling generous, because it's a rogue light, I will use the sword this time. I don't think I've... I don't think I've upgraded it at all. What is this? You do this? Sure do that, whatever. For three seconds after your special your attack, you may deal critical damage. Okay, whatever. Yeah, so I use this. I never. I don't use this other thing. I don't think I've upgraded it at all. All right, Hades run starts now. Prepare. Uh, oh, and I should probably put some of these things on, eh? That'll like even it out, right? Uh, here I'll do this. I'll do uh hard labor, and I'll put that on. Here, I'll do that too. Does that sound good? Plan? Stick to the plan? Sword is boring. Should I use something else? What is the plan? What is the plan? What on earth is the plan? What are you talking about? You can't know the plan. Olympus calls. I'm very worried about what you guys are talking about. Your attack is stronger and can deflect. That sounds very good. I think I'll take that. No questions asked. I like the ones from uh, the Hunter God. She's hot. She's my favorite one. We just have to follow the plan. I have no idea what you guys talking about. Okay, I'm already taking damage. This is going terribly. Come on, Hades music. Give me something more interesting to work with here. What else is going on in my life? Um, I feel like the, the first like wave here is kind of like brainless. Like you just like you know, like go through. I'm trying to think of something to talk about. A uh, new video? Eh, not soon. Uh, working on it currently, but um, you know it'll be like a couple weeks. Because uh, I like I I uploaded the Japan one a week ago, right? Um, but I also haven't worked on really anything since then. I've been working a little bit. I've been playing some wizard games to kind of like make a video on that. I've been like playing them and taking some notes on them. So I want to do another wizard games video. And then another one I want to do soon. I actually, I, I thought about making a video on roguelikes. And then I feel, like, I feel like that topic's just been kind of done a lot. You know what I'm saying? I feel like people talk about roguelikes all the time. Um, but if not roguelikes, I want to do one on rhythm games. Because I really like rhythm games. I feel like I could make an interesting video about that sort of thing. What wizard games have you been playing? I have a list. Um, still playing some Noita. I, I'm, I've been trying to like keep with, with mostly like wizard games that most people don't know about. Uh, like more obscure ones. Because like Dragon's Dogma came out and that's terrible and everyone else is terrible. So it's like, I, I feel like it's not interesting for me to talk about that. Because, like, everyone knows it's terrible. I, I feel like it would be more interesting if I talked about, like, lesser known games that no one's heard of and be like, hey, you know, it was a really cool one. I feel like that's how it was with Wasted of Legend. I feel like not a lot of people... I mean, it, it did all right. It's, an, you know, a decent amount of people know about it. But I feel like I, I let a lot more people know about Wizard of Legend with my original Wizard game video, and that was fun. Uh, same thing with CrossCode. A lot of people told me they played CrossCode for my second Wizard game video. And I'm happy. I like that. That was fun. Uh, Death of Finance restores more hearts than usual. Punish one use. That'd be really good if I didn't have it right now. When you deflect attacks, it deals more damage. <laughs> <clears throat> hey Joe, it's Jack making an omelet. Lol, I know a couple Jacks. 
Um, I'm gonna be more specific. I'm taking a lot of damage here. This is not great. Maybe don't say your last name, but you know, a couple of jacks. Would you even consider playing Sea of Thieves? What do you? I play Sea of Thieves all the time. Like you mean on stream? I think I'm gonna stream it when the new update comes out. My? Did you see my last? Like not my last video, but my video two videos ago. I love Sea of Thieves. I play the game all the time. <laughs> Not in this stream, I'm not gonna play on this stream. But eventually on stream, yeah, of course. Your attack restores two hearts per hit. But that seems really good. Your special hits a wider area and deals 20% more damage. That seems very good, I think I want that. What is that? What is this thing? The feather? I don't know who that is. Shout out Jack, oh Jack from college. I'm aware, I know this Jack. When are we hanging out Jack? Oh! Jack! I have rocks for you! I just remembered! Jack, I have rocks for you! I have rocks for you and Musa! <laughs> okay, so, for context, my friend Jack, the one in chat right now, him and um, my old roommate Musa, um, they're really into geography. Or, or ge geology. They're into rocks. Geology. Yeah, it's rocks. Uh, so I, I bought... Uh, I didn't buy them. When I was in Texas, I just like I went and I found some rocks that I thought looked cool, and I got some rocks for them. <laughs> they have like a, a rock, like I don't even know what it is. It's like a it simulates like erosion to make the rocks smoother. So they have like this little machine in their garage that runs like twenty four seven. It's just like they put sand in it and a bunch of rocks, and it just spins. It spins for like weeks, and it, it like smooths out the rocks. And you put like different grits of sand in it. It's like the funniest thing ever. They're so excited when they showed me. Uh, so I got some I got them some rocks to put in there. <laughs> A tumbler, that's the word. Yeah, yeah. I just take damage, uh, damage, and, and completely chill your core. Uh, when you have no, okay. Special stronger inflicts chill. That's pretty good. So next time we hang out, I got some rocks to give to you. This seems good. I'll take this. Everyone, stick to the plan now. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'd love for this this plan to work out. Any second now. That's the survive. Ow. Maybe I should be staying in the middle of this room. I thought that's occurring to me. Should I take guesses on what the plan is? Well, I have a lot less health uh, with that, that blessing. And it's useful that I can like regenerate it, but I have a lot less health. Wait, how much do you have? You, you start with, you start with a hundred. Okay, wait, so uh, it's, not that, it's not that bad. No more of this buffoonery. Buffoonery. Uh, that one gives me health. What does the pomegranate do? I don't remember. Plan is in place. Jake, can you leave, please? We need to discuss the plan amongst ourselves with people who don't know. Yeah, I got you. I'll leave for a second. No, we're not doing that. Ow. What do these little, like, rocks do that you throw? I never understood these. Your attack is stronger and can deflect that. Oh, you got this upgrade. Some of the things I have. Cool. Take that. The blessing. Hmm. Ask for six encounters. Seems pretty good. Good shit. Um, and I want money or purple thingies. Probably. Purple thing? I don't remember what I don't even remember what these do. It's a little bit this game's a little bit um like trickier to, to read chat, like keep up with chat with. 
Everyone just joining, by the way, we're on game number three. I lost... Uh, I got one shot in, in Risk of Rain 2. And then I tragically misplayed because of one shatter asking me a question, and I and I got distracted in, uh, in Inscription. We're game number three now. Uh, Hades and I'm, like, slightly candy-capping myself to make up for the fact that it is a, a rogue light Instead of a roguelike, you know? So... Okay, you guys want me to leave that bad? Okay, I'm gonna leave to eat an orange. Okay, does that sound good? I'm gonna get some food. Okay, you guys got probably 30 seconds, okay? What? Go talk, discuss your plan. Okay. Have fun. Okay, I'm leaving. Sorry, I was looking for the right music there. I cut you guys. I cut you in the act. I didn't leave at all. <laughs> I had the orange with me this whole time. I had it here in preparation. I was reading all of your messages. I know everything that you're trying to say. I know it all. I know it all. You're just going to stay quiet, are you? Hmm. 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 I think you're so slick. You think you're so slick. The orange was here the whole time, motherfuckers. I didn't leave it all. And it's delicious. Mmm, it's such a sweet orange. Did I like your plan, though? Absolutely not. Absolutely terrible plan. You're just gonna not say anything in chat? <laughs> I just won't read your messages, then. I've been to the Great White North. I've been to Toronto once, and it was shit. I hated Toronto. I went there for a hockey tournament. You idiots. You know nothing. Okay. Anyways. Back to this. Now I have my orange. Next time, think of a better plan. I was just saying. Get better. Shrimply get better. Go to the shop now. Anyways, hello from the better part of Canada. <laughs> oh, yeah. This. When you're hit, you have a chance to dodge a mod clip. Okay. Your dash creates a braid lift. Your attack speed cast your attack special and cast more damage. That's just good. That's just generally good. Farewell, my friend. Should I get risk of rain too? I think you should. It's a great game. Oh, this one's weird. She like teleports you and shit, doesn't she? I can like reflect all of her shit back at her though. That's huge. This would be very easy for a guy like me. I think this might be too easy. Okay, where am I? This might be potentially 
too easy of a game. I might, maybe I was supposed to put more things on myself. Although the first boss is always easy. Like it gets it gets harder later on, doesn't it? I feel like I can get to Hades no problem. I feel like I can get to the boss no problem. So we cannot even join the game. Well, I don't really like. I'm gonna get shit on a little bit for this, but I don't really like Hades that much. <laughs> it's too easy. Uh, it yeah, I don't like rogue lights. They're just, it's not like as it's not as satisfying to beat them. You know what I'm saying? Plan C is only say orange. Great, great plan, guys. Um. I just, roguelites, it's like, you don't get the satisfaction from beating it, you know? It's like, when you beat a roguelike, it's like, yeah, I'm a, like, you know, I overcame the challenge. Like, the challenge was always the same, and I got better. With roguelites, it's like, okay, the game just, it, it got easier. Like, it, you can play the game more, and it just becomes easier for you to beat. It's lame. That's why I was upset that um, Wizard of Legend 2 is going to be a roguelite. I like the challenge. Like, that's the reason I play roguelikes, is for the challenge. I don't like that they just artificially make the game easier for me. Shut up about Ravita! I got it! I watched the trailer, bro! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! You should be watching. Always watching. Just like me. Hell yeah. I should like steal this guy's kill, shouldn't I? Fuck, he's all like... Don't chaos me, don't chaos me! Got him. Fuck. Chaos him. Chaos, nice. I think I won. We tied. Uh, your dash strike deals more damage. Your okay, that's good. Take that. Where did he go? Where bitch boy go? Sweet max life. Oh yeah. Let me leave. Uh, I'll go here. Opinion on the next DLC for Ghost coming down too. I actually didn't even see the trailer, to be honest with you. I didn't watch it. Your specialist drummer inflicts chill. I'll take this. No use. Have to use the fountain? Okay. To my help, although I'm full. Moving right along. Have you heard of Gunfire Reborn? Yeah, it's on the it's on the uh, Gunfire Reon Reborn is on the list, actually. Uh I actually I haven't played it. It's it's on the wheel. I have it, I played like two rounds of it, so I think it should be a fairly difficult challenge for me. Even though it's a roguelite. I bought it because it looked like a wizard game to me. <laughs> and it kind of is. There's some, there's some spells. Um, Radiation heals must be critical. After you cast. Good. Artemis, guide my hand. How do I leave? Get me out of here. I think... After we beat this one or lose, I think I'm gonna take it off the list, to be honest with you. It just feels too easy. Maybe I'm just too good at the game. I put the, the modifiers on to make it hard. Maybe it'll show up in like the later game. Maybe it'll get harder, who knows. I know that this, uh, the boons that I picked, like this, this arrow one is like very good. It's just like free damage. Did you play Hell Divers with Spencer? Oh, wait a minute. You're the. Wait, you're Jack from the friend group with Spencer in it. This is a different Jack than the one I was thinking of. See, I told you I knew, I knew multiple Jacks. Fuck. I think I have something for you too, Jack. Jack, I have a fucking, I have a present for you from Japan. Oh, I do have something for you though, Jack. I have 
a present for you from Japan that I brought back for you specifically. Because when I was in Japan, there was a huge earthquake. There was a huge, like the biggest earthquake since 2011. Um, and Jack was the only motherfucker to reach out to me and be like, hey, are you like not dead? He was the only one that was like, hey, are you alive? Like, are you good? And I was like, I appreciated that, Jack. So I bought um, a present for you. Next time I see you, I'll give it to you. I mean, I was, like, very far away from where the earthquake was, but I appreciated that he, like, asked if I was okay. <laughs> Look at this. I like, this is like, such a clusterfuck. Like, I'm just, I can just, like, click. Um, and never die. <laughs> okay, um, more health or shop. I don't have a lot of money, so I'll go for the, uh, I'll go for the health, I guess, yeah. Plan J, we must all ask stuff pretending to be named Jack. Sweet max health. Diamond, huge. Uh, by the way, to answer your question, I never played Helldivers with Spencer. I played twice, but he keeps asking me. He keeps asking me to play, and I'm like, why do you say I'm gonna, I'm gonna play with him again? But uh, it's been kind of a while <laughs> since I played Helldivers with him. This guy just get melted. Look at him. Can I backstab? No. Hey, I have, I have, if I drop below, like, I just don't take damage. It's insane. Things are all dead. Now I kill this guy. Full health again. This feels cheap. I feel like I'm cheating. I feel like I'm cheating if I win using this. Have you heard of em em Ember Bane? It seems like a cool game coming out. Um, no. Is it a... What kind of game is it? I'm happy that the uh, the Japan video is like it kind of took a while to get like going, but it's doing honestly better than I expected. Because I expected it to get very like little views, because it's you know not really like the um, kind of video that I typically upload on the channel. Um, but I when like. I don't know. I was talking to my friend to Owen about it. Same Owen that I play Risk of Rain with. And he was like, yeah, if you just like do it in the exact same like editing style as you do like your normal videos, I think it'll be interesting. And I think he was right. I think I made it an interesting video about Japan. Uh, at least at least I thought it was unique. You know, there's like, there's so many like, I moved to Japan. Wow, awesome videos on the on YouTube. I tried to like make mine stand out a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Um, and like slowly over time, it's been kind of like a... a, a like getting more views over time instead of like just popping off like super quickly like the other ones typically do, which is good. I'm happy about that. Um, uh, what should I call it? And also, fucking a big YouTuber followed me because of it on Twitter. You guys know C Dog VA? He followed me on Twitter <laughs> because of that Japan video I did. So I tried to like message him, but I think he's uh, doing a biking thing right now, so he doesn't respond to me. That's cool. So yeah, I got friends in higher places. Now what is this? Why do I have this unlocked? Why do I have that on? I don't usually use like the collar or something. No, that's not what I use. What is the one that I usually use? I think this thing they have right now is not good. It should be one I have like three start on. This one. Automatically restore. Okay, so this is an extra death defy. Yeah, whatever, I'll take that. Or no, the arrow, that's what I use. Oh wait, no, that's not great. Uh, I like the lucky tooth, I guess. Free death defy. Eh, that's not great. Huh. 
I think it's very good. <laughs> I'll take the extra death to fight, I suppose. And I'm out of here. I'm almost beating it, guys. Let us hide some time. You want me to leave again? You want me to... Does it? Uh, do I like XCOM 2? I've never played XCOM 2. Sorry, you asked that question like 10 times. I just... I don't know what I'll do every time. I just ignored you. I'm sorry. I feel bad for that. Um... I've never played XCOM 2. I don't even know what kind of game it is, to be honest. I don't even know what I... I, I know... I've heard of the game, and I feel like if I saw it, I would know what it is. I don't even know what, I, what you do in XCOM. Look how easy this is. I put the modifiers on to make it harder. I don't know what I'm doing. Very easy. Trap kill. Awesome. Oh, wait, don't let me respawn. Stop. What do we have here? Uh, I want the extra damage. Good. What is this? I don't want that. Um, the hammer upgrades my attacks. Have you played Risk of Rain Returns? I have not. Um, and I have a reason that I haven't. Because I, I was playing, again, with Owen. I was talking to Owen. He said he didn't like it very much, so I didn't play it. I just trusted his judgment. I trusted what he said. Too easy. Um, although, I don't know. Maybe I'll give it a shot. I, I like Risk of Rain 2 a lot. I'm a big fan of Risk of Rain 2. So, maybe I will play it. Uh, your attack fires a wave that pierces foes during 30 day damage. Your special hits twice, but no longer locks foes away. Your dash strike hits twice and deals 20% damage. That'd be good. Uh, ooh, like a double for this one. He's getting us too weak and unorganized. He's afraid of our true potential when we unite as one. What are you talking about? Is it a fan fiction? Uh, after using Death Defiance, do more damage to that encounter. That's going to be very good for the final boss. Oh, she's pissed. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Demeter. We can talk about this. It's okay. So uh, we're gonna have to make a decision soon. Wait, I, I'm just about to die. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh shit! Oh wait, I thought they have death defy things. Yeah, that's kind of a dumb use. We're gonna make a decision soon. On the cast drops a crystal that fires a beam at foes. Uh, playing ten stacks of chill causes a blast, clearing the effect. Call creates a wind of void. I don't even remember what call is. We're gonna make a decision soon on whether or not we count this. Is <laughs> that a feeling? Although I did just, yeah, I did just use one death defying. So I don't know. Maybe there's a chance I lose this. This feels like a very easy win for me. I'm wondering if I should just take it out. Is there any other way to make this more difficult for myself? How about I let you guys pick like my uh, my item or whatever? I let you guys I let chat pick the boons. That's how I, that's how we make it hard. We let you guys pick all the boons. That would make it way harder. We should pick all the shit ones. If you win, you should get on. 
Ravita. Shut up about Ravita, please. What are our thoughts on that? Play with only a keyboard? I mean, don't use... How does that even work? Just... How do I, how do I attack, then? Uh, I could get a good boon from her. Or I could go to the shop and probably get more. I'll do that. X button? X button does not work. I probably could just rebind the controls. Uh, burst of damage, batteries. After you your foe, your next attack special. Ooh. Sounds good. Take this too. I'll go here. Play Gungeon while you play Hades for difficulty. <laughs> you guys might be surprised. You guys might be surprised with my ability in, in Enter the Gungeon. You guys might be a little bit impressed, even. If you saw me play Gungeon. I'm well known in the Gungeon community, let's just say that. Okay, can this thing die, please? This thing never dies. Look at this. I got infinite health here, though. Kill it, Demeter. Fuck it up, girl. There we go. Kill this thing. All right, huge. Ultra kill. I have ultra. I've never actually opened ultra kill because I don't believe in uh, early access games. I don't believe in playing them. Uh, so I bought ultra kill just because I know that the price is going to increase once it goes out of early access. But the second I think it's out of early access, once it's a real game, then I'll play it. Deadly strike. Your attack is stronger. Uh, with new speed. Ooh. Ooh. Replace Divine Strike. Hmm. Any damage you deal is a chance to be critical. Oh, you cast Seek's Foes. <sighs> that seems pretty good. Making out of Hades with this one. What's up, Manly Reviews? Welcome in. What is this thing? What on earth is that? I'm going here. Any uh, new videos, uh, Mr. Manly Reviews? It's been a while, bro. Get on it. What is this deal? Uh, replenish all the death the, the defiance for the next five chambers restore 30%. The next 10 encounters your attack deals 60% damage. Uh, I guess take that. Get my death defiance back. Now what? Give me the key. Losing reflect isn't great here. I lost reflect. I didn't do that. Yeah, it's been a crazy but year, but wrapping up with a Dark Souls now. Ooh. Um, here's my thing about Dark Souls. I think that Sekiro is better. And I'm not afraid to say that. I liked Sekiro way better than any Dark Souls game. And I'm like the only person in the universe who thinks that way, I think. Sekiro is like way... I just... I hate rolling and dodging away from everything like a, like a pussy in Dark Souls. I don't know. It's just so much more satisfying in... Uh, in Sekiro, you get to like you just block it, and it's like a rhythm game. You just like you get all the the deflex in. It feels so like when you get like eight perfect blocks in a row. Like, dude, nothing is better than that. And every dude, the thing about Sekiro that annoys me as well is every like negative review on on Steam is literally just Dark Souls fanboys going, "It's not like Dark Souls. I can't roll." It's like it would be called Dark Souls if it was Dark Souls. It's not Dark Souls. That's why it's called Sekiro. It it annoys me. It annoys me. You would scam both, haha. Yeah! Scam Boy likes it too, doesn't he? Dude, I love Sekiro. 
This Scamboy like came out of his closet recently too. Like his his fucking his editing dungeon. He like he took like a nine month break. What is that guy up to for nine months? And then he finally uploaded. Uh, what do we got here? We deflect attacks deals more damage. Yeah. Okay. Better blessing. You should do World of Horror to the rogue like list. I haven't played these games though before though. Like I'm just gonna I'm guaranteed to lose these ones you guys want me to add. Like it's like I would that even be interesting to watch because it's like I've I've never ever played it before. Is that even? Do you even want to watch that? This guy would please shut up. If this guy would shut up, I would be very happy. Oh, the bulls. He activated his anime mode. I'm going to beware. It's your brain. It's like just a click. Like you just click infinitely in this game. It's too. Look, it's just too easy. Like you do nothing. This is like a mind rot roguelike. I guess it looks cool in the story. It was alright. Easy. I do this flawless, I think. I just regain my health here. I do it flawless. Watch. Oh no! I lose one. That's unfortunate. Like, I went back earlier, so this is kind of like. This is okay. Come on, Theseus. And then this, this is the last one, and then I go to the, the boss area, right? The Hades area? Ah! We're fine. No, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Oh no, I had to use two. Okay, wait a minute. Hang on. This is getting a little bit... I'm sweating a little bit. Ravita better. Stop talking about Ravita! I'm gonna lose my mind. Next time you guys mention next time you bring up you bring up Ravita, I I'm taking it off the wish list and I'm never playing it. Sekiro is perfect. Uh, for fair gameplay, Dark Souls scratches a different itch, which is more like leveling his gears exploration maxing. That's probably why I don't like it as much, because I don't I'm not a big um whatchamacallit. I don't like RPGs. So that's probably got something to do with me not liking it as much. I'm not um any effects to reason twenty five percent. I don't like RPGs very much. I don't like leveling stats. I don't like, you know, the whole like searching for better armor. I'm not a fan of it. Uh next six encounters. Okay. I'm almost out of here. It's an it's a honer type game? Is that a new like is it like Gooner? Did you like Elden Ring? Did I play probably like three hours of Elden Ring and I gave up? <laughs> uh, I didn't dislike it, but I was like, I don't know. I just didn't, I, I wasn't even like a, I, I didn't have fun and I didn't keep playing. It was just, it was literally like, I was like, okay, I played it. I got off for the day and I never, I just never felt the itch to go back. Um, go this way. Okay, I lost two death defies. My, my chances of winning this just went down, I think. It's okay. We just be trapped here for a bit longer. You guys don't mind that. You guys love watching me suffer. Dark Souls requires a five hour bullshit phase to get good, sadly. I played the only so the only Dark Souls game I played was Dark Souls 3. And I remember the when I played it, um, like me and like three of my friends all got it at the same time. Um 
I mean, three of my friends at the same time, and we're all playing, we're like in a call together playing it, and the first boss probably took me like, this was in high school, so I wasn't as much of a, an elite gamer as, I'm not, I was not the elite gamer specimen that you see before you today. Um, but it took all my friends mm, like three tries, and then it took me like nine or ten tries. It took me like a significantly more tries than any of them, and that scared me. That scared me. Uh, and I kept playing it, and I just I never really got into it. But I played Sekiro, like, 30 seconds of Sekiro, and I was hooked. Tasty, sort of. Townscaper stream? I wanted to make him play Revita and turn it into a joke. Didn't know it would turn into this. <laughs> what have you done? Okay, let's not lose our other death to fight here, eh? It's not like fuck around and find out, you know. It's not mess up here. That would suck, because then I'm definitely guaranteed to lose. I need at least one death of five for Hades. I don't know if I can beat it without that. Come meet my blade. Come meet my blade. I like the voice acting in this one. That's one thing I appreciate about this game. The voice acting is genuinely very good and it's written very well. There's so many cringe voice acting out there in video games these days. I'm going to call it out. I'm here to expose the industry. I'm tired of complacency in the gaming industry. Why do we allow shit voice actors that sound like weird anime dubs? Oh, no. It's, oh, shit. Well, this is not good, guys. This is not going well suddenly. This is like my chances of winning this have gone down significantly. I'm here to make a stand. No more pretending, oh, they're all good voice actors. It's just that you don't like the translation. No, I'm tired of it. I'm making a stand. Why do all voice actors in video games sound terrible? What's going on? And I'm not talking like there's like the big budget ones, like a lot of them with, um, I don't know, like Last of Us 2. Those are all good voice actors. But any like indie game that, I don't know, they just all sound so terrible. They, like you, you know what they sound like, right? It's the anime dub voice that, that, that irks me. Uh, after you deal critical damage to a foe, that close a foe near it is marked. You know, they, they I don't even know how to like replicate it. It's a, it's just a, such a unique like sound that they make. Yeah, I guess it is expensive, but why? I don't know. I just, I don't know why they all sound like they're from anime. It's so, it's very weird. Um, I go here. Play risk of range returns. I think I will. But here's my here's my other thing. I've never in my life really minded reading in a video game. I never really if you know if you can't get a good voice actor like because it's like it's it fucking like ruins the experience in some games. Like the story is like ruined by terrible voice actors. Sometimes they sound like anime characters. It's like any like semblance of a game being serious at all is like ripped to shreds when I hear one of those voice voice actors. Um, so I'm like, what if you just let me read it? I'd be okay with that. I wouldn't mind that at all. Call it a controversial opinion. What controversial opinions do I have about video games? So I don't like. I said I, I preferred Sekiro to Dark Souls. That's controversial opinion number one. Not into most voice actors. That's controversial opinion number two. What else do we have? I don't like RPGs. That's controversial. Um, oh, here's a controversial one. I never played Halo. I've never, I mean, I've never played the Halo story. I've played the multiplayer plenty. Especially at like, like friends' houses and shit, like, like land parties or like the split screen. Played that plenty. I've never played the Halo story. And I want to. I have like, I have a list of like game, like a gaming backlog. Have you guys seen, um, you guys seen Terrell, Daryl Talks Games? He made a video about gaming backlogs, and so I was inspired, and I made a, uh, I made a backlog, like a list, in order that I'm going to do it. And Halo, the Halo games are on the list. I'm going to play them. But I feel guilty. I feel like I'm missing out. Another one I have never played? I've never played um, Call of Duty Black Ops 2. No, 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 no. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. I've never played it. Because my thing was, when I was a kid, I, I always, like since the day I was born, I've hated Call of Duty games. Or I, I've only played them sparingly at friends' houses. But, like, I've never looked at a Call of Duty game in my life. And I'm kind of proud about myself for this. 
I've never looked at a Call of Duty game in my life and man, gone, damn, that looks like fun. <laughs> they just don't look fun to me at all. They look so boring, all of them. The cast sends a bleed rift. Uh, that's good. Whatever. How do I get out of here? I'm free. Free me. Do you like RTS? Uh, depends on the RTS. Very much depends on what the RTS is. Uh, I think I'm gonna play at least the first four because I hear the first. I hear, I hear the fifth one sucks, and I've heard mixed things about the, the fourth one. So I'll, I think I'll give at least the first four plus uh, reach a, a shot. You should play Magicraft. I think someone DM'd me on Twitter and recommended me that game. It's a Metro Vineyard, but it's more like cross code. Don't lynch me, but I don't care for Sea of Thieves. That's fine. Dude, you know the funniest thing about my, my video on um on Sea of Thieves is like the community in that game is like they're so split. It's hilarious. I got so if you don't know Sea of Thieves, there's like there's like kind of like two parts of the community. There's the side that likes PvP, and there's the side that likes exploring and the PvE aspects of the game, and they hate each other. And the funniest thing is that I think the game does a pretty good job of catering to both sides. But both and, and I I personally as well, I like both the PvP aspect of Sea of Thieves and the PvE aspect, like the finding treasure and stuff. I like both of those parts. So I find like I'm like in the middle. But there's the people like there's there's the two like I don't know, the two sections that that only like one part and they hate each other and both sides think that the other side is like getting way more updates and like getting is getting like way more love from the developers and i feel like it's just not true because i got like an, pretty much an even amount of comments on that video from like see if these players being like yeah this game's good but like could be good but like the developers hate the pve players and then like two comments later, it's like yeah the game could be good but the developers hate the pvp players and it's like maybe you guys are just both equally being taken care of it's funny Oh shit! I gotta start paying attention. I gotta walk in. I've not been locking in. I'm gonna lose now. I have no more death defies. Any other see at these players out here? Magicraft is just good noita. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. Noita kind of has been growing on me. Noida kind of grows on me, like, every time I play it. I, I, I kind of like it a little bit le better every time. Yeah, the two sides of the Sea of Thieves community think their idea of how the game should be played is objectively correct one. Dude, the, the, thing, the thing that's special about Sea of Thieves is that they're both, like, equally the correct way to play the game. And it's, like, it's, like, very impressive that that game really does let both sides flourish. And I feel like it's just so many people, they don't think that they think that only the other side is getting love. But really, it's very impressive how well it does both sides. That's what I like about the game. Uh, when you cast, get chill, bonus restoration. Uh... I don't think I'm gonna get any though. Wait, I think that works for my healing thing. Dude, where is the freaking meat at? I just wanna like I just wanna get out of here. I gotta like find the meat for this dog. Where the dog at? The dog. Can you please pet that dog? How do you have such a beautiful and soothing voice? Many would disagree with you, I think. I have a very high-pitched voice. I'm insecure about that. <laughs> I don't know. I my voice is like I don't know. I have I, my voice is a very like wide spectrum because I feel like if I if I talk like I don't know. I feel like when I talk, like my the high points of my like my sentences they get high, but also like I, when I talk like base level, it's like it's like decently deep. 
You know what I'm saying? Like if I talk like right here, like not like emphasizing anything, that's that's all right. That's kind of deep. Fuck, I just a voice cracked. My voice cracked. We're moving on. We are moving on. We're moving on. <laughs> you kind of sound like Super the TF. I don't sound like anything like Super. What are you talking about? His voice is way deeper than mine. Thank you. You like my voice? Thank you. Thank you. I was. I'm not actually insecure about it. I'm chilling, uh, but I appreciate it. Um, and I also I talk fast, and that's something I've been trying to do less of. Um, I think the reason I talk fast in most of the videos is because I record those lines. A lot of them take me like, it's so rare for me to like record a line correctly on the first try. So most of the time I record it like four or five times. And by that time I'm just impatient. I just want to be done with it. So it just becomes like super like, fast. Um... All right, final boss, lock in. I'm gonna be really upset if um, I almost like don't want to win. <laughs> Um, because I've like, I practiced a bunch of these games for this and I feel like it would be like, you know, what a waste if I just win on the roguelite when I practice like all these other games specifically for this, this stream and for this video that it'll be, it will become. Wait for the cast to come out. I'm pretty good right now. Kill him. Kill him, Demeter. Get him. What is that noise? What is that noise being made? The boom, 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 boys. I don't like that noise. Okay. Um, things are getting a little dicey. Damn, couldn't even win. The, couldn't even beat the roguelite. It's over. It's over. Anyways, we go next. We go next. We go next. I'm getting kind of hungry, though. We gotta wrap this up soon, boys. We gotta wrap this up. Wrong note. Wrong one. Back to the wheel. Wait, 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 with the with the uh, event was I should remove the ones that I've already beaten, right? I've already played, right? So we like get, we kind of get through them all. Let's remove risk of rain two. Let's remove inscription. Uh, let's remove Hades. That's all three of the ones I did, right? And I wonder if I should get rid of dead cells too, just because I don't want to play another roguelite that I can eat. But I feel like I'm not as good as, as dead cells. Have I played Skull the Hero Slayer? I have not. Dude, I don't have Revita. Do you guys want me to put Revita on there just so I can, like, I, I open it and then die instantly? Is that what it's going to take? Should I put Revita on there? Day nine, 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 nine of asking Jay to play Golden Treasure, the Great Green. I don't know what these games are. Fine. If, if it'll get you guys to shut up about Ravita, I'll put Ravita on there. But I'm not going to buy it until I land on it, okay? Ravita. Does that make you guys happy? What color do you want Ravita to be? There. Oh, wait. I don't want that. Okay. No, 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 no. Enter the gadget, baby! Let's go! Oh, oh, oh. You've all been waiting for it. The moment you've all been waiting for. 
Let's go. Enter the gungeon. I use quick start because I'm a, I'm a beast. Hang on, I got to turn my music on. I have the music off early because I was listening to a podcast. All right. Let's go. I haven't even used any of my resets, by the way, either. It's gungeoning time. So, I'm going to... I think if I, like, get a really bad, like, start early on... Because I'm playing, um... I'm playing Pilot, and he, it's, he's a little bit luck-based on the first, uh, in Keep of the Lead Lord, the first stage. So I kind of want to, if I just get a terrible luck with, like, with my lock picks or with my chest in the first uh, first floor, here's what we'll do with the reset. I can only reset if it's on the first stage. That sound good? That's that's the new plan. If I get terrible like luck the first stage, I'll reset. Terrible, terrible, terrible shop, unlucky. Otherwise we go for it. We go all in. Robots. Uh blue chest, I don't want that. We got it for free. Oh yeah. Doesn't seem very good. What is the DPS? Somebody look up the DPS on the tank gun for me. Okay, and then obviously we're going to the secret stage. Obviously we're going to the secret stage. We can't not. We really can't not. Whoa, this thing fires way faster than I thought it did. Uh, okay, fine, whatever I see it now. Unfortunate. So I guess this just fires as fast as you click, huh? I'll probably keep using this until I find another gun. 24 DPS? Okay. That's not terrible. Honestly, I think, my, I think my biggest, like, challenge, um, potential for losing this game is if I'm reading chat or something. <laughs> I'm not paying attention in Eyelays. There's a boss room. We're obviously going for a flawless boss run to get the, the, uh, the master round and then trying to go to the R&D department if we, if the run looks, uh, winnable enough. Honestly, like, first floor. That was very easy. Dude, I had such a god run the other day while I was practicing this. I kept getting the, um, I just, like, completely flawless the first, like, three floors. And then every single one, the, uh, the vampire lady that trades you, like, uh, money for hearts, she showed up on, like, every single one of them. And so I just got, like, infinite, uh, money from her because I just kept, like, I used her and then I just got my health back with the, uh, the extra lives I kept finding. I, she's not in this one, is she? I didn't, I didn't see her. She wasn't in the shop. I already deleted the shop this morning. We should run a poll. Dude, that's what we did last time. We did like the, the betting thing on will he win slash not win. Oh, that's on Twitch though. You can't do that on this one. Oh no, on YouTube. Dude, YouTube is so lame. You ever played Risk of Rain Returns? I have not. Are we just going to be a quick one? Shut up. You don't know me. You don't know anything about me. Okay, twins. I would have liked to get not the twins. But to me personally, twins is better than bird. 
I really hate the bird guy. He's definitely my least favorite. I think I can kill him before I run out of ammo. Sweet. Five ammo left. We get it flawless. We get the master round. That's huge. I think you guys are sweating. I think you guys are sweating a little bit. You guys are terrified that I'm going to be able to beat this first try. What is this? Can someone look up Dark Marker DPS for me? Bird with water lanes is the worst. That's literally like hell. That's like my nightmare. Can I check for secret rooms? No, we know you're a throw. I want throw. You don't know anything about me, boy. Um, secret room, secret room. I don't think there's any chance no one being here. No. Um, not here either. Unfortunate. Isn't there like a higher chance of there being secret rooms in the dead end ones as well? I chuck over here. Charge the dark marker. <laughs> it sucked. Someone said dark marker sucks. Okay, I see no secret room here. Unfortunate. Uh, I don't have any of the ammo in my other one though, so we kind of have to use it. And oh, was there a key here being sold? There was, okay. I don't really want to risk using the lockpicks on this, because then the, I guess the room would be kind of over. <laughs> if, uh, if the lockpick failed once. Uh, maybe I will. Nah, I won't. Play it safe. Oubliette. This doesn't seem that bad to me. Oh, okay, there you go. That seems pretty good. Is it a blank, too? Seems pretty good to me. Should probably try to reserve that ammo, though, until I get another gun. Now you guys are getting scared that I'm doing this so flawlessly so far. Just saying. I feel the fear in your eyes. In your hearts. I feel you quivering in fear. Quivering. That's not, that's not a word that I like, to be honest with you. That's a word that kind of irks me. It just brings bad things to mind. You 100% this game, one of the best games I've played, top like 20-ish. I am not a 100%er, to be honest with you. I don't 100% game, I just don't do it. There's like, ooh, that was almost bad. There's like two games that I've ever 100%ed. Um, one of them is Doki Doki Literature Club Plus. <laughs> uh, blue chest, I'll use the lockpick. Dang it. Unfortunate. Dude, uh, pilot plus there's an item that like, it gives you better luck when you break chests. That's like the most broken combo ever. You just get like infinite keys. What is this? Is this good? Flare gun? I don't think I remember that being very good. I might just refuel this one. Maybe I should have waited though, cause I'll probably get ammo. Showing. Still yet to take damage. Uh, 
Um, but things are looking a little bit dicey right now. Yeah, I think Enter the Gungeon is probably my favorite roguelike. Uh, I think I might even say I like it better than, better than Wizard of Legend. I think dare I say. And dude, it took me a long time to like realize how good this game is, though. I've had this game. Fuck! That sucks. That's such a dumb way to take damage, too. To the one random enemy left in the room. That sucks. That's heartbreaking. Um. What was I saying? I don't have any keys for you. Maybe I'll get one later. Who knows? Check for your secret room, so never mind. I've had this game for years, dude. And I didn't actually beat it for the first time until like a couple weeks ago. <laughs> like, honestly. I just like, I finally grinded the shit out of it. Finally, like, learned how to play it well. And just popped the fuck off. Extra blank. That's good, I guess. <laughs> Gungeon over everything else. I guess it's fair. I also played some some faster than light. Why is it such a bullshit game, bro? That game is. I don't care what anyone says. That game is so. Have you guys? I don't know if you guys played faster than light. It's so luck based. It's like frustrating how much like good luck you need in that game. Like your weapons can just like they just have like a random percent chance to just not hit anything all the time. It's like all your systems. Every little every single thing is like has a percent chance to just not work. It's really annoying. And even like every location you get, you visit is like a percent chance. Like, will this be dog shit or will it be good? It's very frustrating. Can wait for the obscure flash game stream. What are we doing now? Is that your way of giving me a suggestion for a video type or a stream? Could be an interesting stream idea. Push this back the edge. Let's get a friend. Oh, okay. That tracks you, apparently. I didn't know that. I almost jumped off the edge there. That was close. Oh, that's the cage. I should probably do that. But I'm trying to win this one, you know? Like, I'm trying to fucking... I'm not trying to unlock shit. I'm trying to fucking win this run. Oh my god, there's so many things in here. Everybody fuck off. I should have used my blank earlier. I should have blanked and not taken that damage. That was stupid. Alright, I'm gonna use the, the lockpick on this just in case. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are you? Oh hey buddy, you set me free. I never thought I'd escape from this cell. Anyways, I'm Tonic. Tonic the Hedgehog. If you look for me on the breach, you're gonna go a little bit faster. <laughs> okay. I need a key for this thing too? Oh my god. But I think I'm probably going to wind up doing that because it's a very good area that I want to go to. Um. I have to charge that to open these chests. Dude. Secret room anywhere? Please, I'm begging you. Secret room, please. No? Okay. <sighs> My luck is not great, but I've already gone past the point of, of resetting. Press to fall asleep. Got dicey there. I hate this attack, but you can't like it. You can't uh, attack it during this. Please die. Simply take more damage, please, if you if you would be so kind. I really hope this gives me a key when I kill it. Okay. 
This is terrible. This is so bad. This is such a terrible situation to be in. But this, I, I trust that my unrivaled Gungeon skill can help me overcome my slightly less than fortunate luck. Dang, I, took, I took damage. Not good. My raw skill will see me through this. Please fuck off. Don't you dare split again, you bastard. Oh, I think. Okay. That sucks. The good thing is, is that it doesn't really matter if you take damage on this guy. Because he doesn't give you a master on anyways. Got two hearts out of that. And no key... That's so tragic. <sighs> okay, so I can either open one of these chests, they're both green, so they probably give me something good, or I can go to bullet, uh, what is this place? If I unlock this, then I have a chance of getting to the, the, the old king's area. If I beat him, that's pretty good. And that will basically guarantee me the win. The shop has a key too? I don't think he does. He does have a key! Yo! That's huge. Okay. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna risk the lockpicks on one of the chests. And then I'm gonna get this, this uh, emblem for sure. It's unfortunate luck that... What is this? Huge. And then I'm gonna use my lockpicks here. We got unlucky. What? We still got a gun? I didn't know you could still get a gun if, if you if you mess up. Is it tell me if the uh Can somebody give me the DPS on both the flame hand and the siren? I didn't know you could still get a gun. I have $20 to, to waste. What game should I play? I'm to the gungeon, bro. Siren is good. I didn't know that you could get guns even if you destroy the chest. That's good for me. Okay, so I need... Flame Hand is 34. That's pretty good. Remind me that armor you get after getting the old crest doesn't go in front of it. You still lose it on your first damage. Yeah, I remember. Thank you. Thank you very much for the reminder. I should probably be using the Mac 10 for this. Although I remember this one was pretty good for bosses as well. Took a free, easy damage. Siren is 32, Flame Hand is 34. So you're suggesting I set fire to them and then switch to a different weapon? That sounds pretty good to me. There's so many guns in this game, dude. Like, it's impossible to remember them all. Especially because you also have to remember like what their DPS is. Because some guns are just like explicitly better than others, you know? Please fucking guys. Save my ammo. I got a couple guns now. Things are looking better for me than they were earlier. These guys are like out of sync. It's very frustrating. Okay, I trust this. I'm glad that I we uh, came to a compromise with the that one game that you guys wouldn't shut up about when we put on the list. I'm glad we were able to find an understanding there. Mega Dasser. Uh, I'll take the key. 
I've never, I've not contributed anything to this. The lazy to the, the rat boss, right? I've seen it on YouTube. I gotta lock the fucking. I need to get to the uh, the old king's area. This guy doesn't damage me, right? I don't know. I don't. Know, I forgot how to fucking. I don't know how to dodge that guy. Okay, apparently like that. Stop! 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 Fuck! He doesn't damage you, right? It doesn't be damage though, right? I have beaten old king before. I have. Okay, he only sent me back one room. Wait, he sent me back a couple. Fuck. It was a pretty good run when I beat Old King. How do you, like, consistently dodge those hand things? Oh, fuck. I forgot about that guy. This enemy is very dangerous. No. No, 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 no. Not this enemy. No, 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 no. I'm not risking that shit. I fucking hate that enemy. I hate that enemy with a burning passion. That enemy has like ended more runs than any of my other any enemy. I swear. Okay, fine. That's funny. Like I got sent to the shadow realm. I got scared. I actually got genuinely scared though. I shit my pants. That enemy has ended more of my runs than any other enemy in this entire game, like including any boss. Okay. Let's get a little bit dicey here. What is that enemy? I've never seen that before. It's just the, squ the squir screwy uh, shotgun. It explodes weird. Dude, where is this freaking old king altar? I'm getting like... This guy's... There's combo to be up. Here. Dude! My luck is so bad. Please give me the shotgun room. Please, or please give me the, the altar room. What? What NPC is this? Also, no... Um... Chest rooms, either. So far. No, 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 no. Die, please. Got a key. I should check if that was a mimic. I really should check if that was a mimic first. That was a blunder on my part. I'm going to do literally this entire floor. I'm going to full clear this floor before I find the goddamn altar room. It's a long time to reload. I'm playing this very safe. I'm just playing very safe right now. I need to get this altar room. That'll change everything for me. That'll turn my run around completely. Dude, give me a break. Uh. Yes. I'm well known. I wasn't worried at all. I was not worried at all, actually. I knew we were going to find that. I knew we were going to find that from the start. Let's redo this room again. Okay, huge. Dark marker is either A tier or S tier gun, really? I believe it. It did a decent amount of damage. But it's done. Lockpicks here. And now I need to find a secret room. I need to. There needs to be a secret room behind one of these. I'm begging. 
should probably save these. This is a pretty good gun. Um, secret room, please. What if I ask really nicely? Damn it. Uh, let me teleport here and unlock this guy. I think that could be a good choice. Oh, I remember this. Yeah, I can do this. Okay. And fire now. Yes. This one's just completely free. Oh, wait, no, there's a, little, there's a couple things in the way. Okay, that was huge. Does it bounce off the regular walls? I forget. I think I just have to time it. No. Unfortunately. Mm. Yes! Huge. Hey, not bad. Take this. Let's go for a green chest. What do we got? Icebreaker. I think that's pretty good. Whew! Um, play while eating snacks and singing. Solvi the Knight has a challenge. Play while eating snacks and singing. Why would I do that? Why on earth would I do that? And why did you message me four times to say that? Okay, which one of these has the highest DPS? I think this is pretty... 36 is pretty high. Doesn't the, the Mac 10 have high DPS? I don't remember. Okay, easy boss huge. Icebreaker's 28. You should play Sap if you haven't. I'm locking in here. I'm talking for a second. Not good. Should have bought an extra blank before I came in. Fuck! No! Damn it, I made it all the way here. No! No! No, my master round is gone. And that... Uh, I wasn't paying attention. This is most unfortunate. Also, I don't have a single passive item yet, do I? I mean, I guess I have those. What is this? Ancient techniques fire to vicious shotgun blast when a table is flipped. Okay. No. Is this good? What's DPS on this? What did you study in Japan? International business. Um, what? Well, that's what I'm going to school in. Um, have you ever played Amori? Yes, I have. It's very good. Um, my degree in America is international business, so I took a couple of classes in Japan around Japanese business practices. 45 is pretty good. Thank you for the look up, by the way. Um, uh, but then specifically when I was in Japan, I also took a lot of classes on like language acquisition and like language theories and shit like that. Um, just because I was into that kind of thing and like... Because, because I'm an international business major, any class that I take that has to do with another country, like Japan, can count towards my international business degree. So I took classes that were about like language acquisition, and they were all taught uh, in Japanese. So those count towards my... Um, Triton is 46.5? Holy shit. Um, so those count towards my degree, even though I was learning about like, like language acquisition theories. Do I have curse? What, what do I have that gives me curse? I got scared. I got scared. I panicked. Oh, 
Oh wait, it's just like all enemies on this floor have like random uh, like like chance to to be jammed, don't they? <laughs> okay, this passive is pretty funny. <laughs> Jammed one first. Damn, I left made a garlic pork and stuff over rice, and you're still running. Rip your luck, I guess. Shush. Shush. I win the gungeon. No chance I lose gungeon. Zero chance. I'm gonna save myself. But I don't do that. I don't make mistakes. A jammed night thingy is a bit scary, but have faith, chat. Have a little bit of faith. It's okay, I'm here. Daddy's here for you. That's weird. I'm not gonna say that again. I'm, not, I'm done saying that. Papa's here for you. Oh, I hate this one. That's good. We need that reload. That was a good reload. Crush reload. Or crutch ammo crate. Oh, the sling is... Oh, the sling's okay. Whatever. Um... I'm gonna wait to give this guy anything. Dude, why do I have no items like in my shops? This is like the, this is the fourth shop, right? Literally not a single one of them has had a passive item for me. This thing is okay because it just, just, it just big damage to bosses. Well, there's other items that do that better. So it's like kind of whatever. Can you fuck off bro? Everybody chill out. Everybody everybody just calm down for a second. This uh table flip one is I feel like this is pretty good actually. Oh god. Oh god, one of these. Oops. Where's my flame thingy? Guys, if I don't beat Gungeon, we're putting Wizard of Legend on the on the list. That's the only way I win this. I have to have confidence in my Gungeon though. This guy's gonna like buff, buff someone. I don't want him doing that. Die, please. It's weird that the water, shooting with water doesn't put out the fire. I should watch that. I forgot you weren't a YouTube overlord, and I can send my me a message where my favorite funny bird will actually see it. What do you mean by YouTube overlord? I am a YouTube overlord. You're trying to tell me I'm not one of those? It's a little rude. Do you like the Warhammer game series? Um, I've never played Warhammer. So I don't know. Honestly, you know my favorite type of game? My favorite type of game is probably... Um, I don't even know. It's not even a genre. It's one of those, you know, the, those... There's a million like it. It's those games that you buy with your friend group. Typically four player, up to four player multiplayer. You play them for two weeks and then never again. And they're like a, a multiplayer, like online multiplayer, like 
game for like five bucks on Steam. And literally, you play them a couple a couple times, and then never again. Those are honestly my favorite types of games. <laughs> you know, talking about like Lethal Company or that new one that just came out. Um, what's it called? Uh, what is that? The one where you like you you go into like the dungeon and you're a fucking YouTuber trying to catch a, a video. Games like that are so fun for me. Just like party games, I guess. Like online card games, but they have to be the ones that I can play online. You know what I'm saying? I hate those games up. Speedrunners was one of those games. Um, that one we actually went back to a couple times though. What's my favorite game of all time is probably Titanfall 2 or Zelda Majora's Mask. That's what I usually say. Gungeon is up there, though. You can see inside chests with mermaid shotgun? What? Oh, the fish tells you. Oh. Does this heart go away? Oh. <laughs> Do you like Risk of Rain? So what's your favorite? Risk of Rain 2 is the only one that I've played. We actually played that about two hours. Oh, fuck, it's like been like three hours of streaming. We played that a few hours ago on stream. That was the first one we played in this uh, this challenge or whatever. I do like Risk of Brain too. I, mean, I enjoy it. <sighs> oh shit! I over dodged. It's okay. I have a um, I have a half heart in reserve. Uh, what needs more ammo? Maybe my Trank gun? I forgot I had half these guns. I should probably use my... I always forget about this feature. Um, yeah, I guess I'll give it the Trank gun. I'll just use this to clear force from now on. Do you play VR? Uh, I do have a VR headset. Uh, give me a shotgun. What do we have in here? Oh, I don't like that thing. The Love Bow. I don't think it's very good. My personal opinion. Give me that. Give me some blanks. I need at least three of these for this boss. Uh, and give me... No, I'm not going to use this thing. I'm, just gonna, I'm probably going to use the trident for most of this fight. I'll take the key as well, I suppose. Should I check for secret rooms first? I think I should. Not with this gun, though. Let's go, secret room. Green chest. Uh, it's the rat note. Not taking it. It's the last one that I need, though. I'm only missing one rat note, but I'm trying to win this run, not... um. Dude, there's one in here too. Uh, okay, I will come back for that if I can. If I can, I need these. Um, I need these blanks for this fight. <laughs> Me and my friend are making Crypt of the Necro Dancer slash Undertale inspired game. Uh, uh, I like Crypt of the Necro Dancer a lot. So I probably would like that game. Guys, you lie to me. This gun doesn't do shit. And I'm already taking damage. This fucking gun doesn't do shit for in terms of damage. And I'm already taking two damage. Oh, no. Dude, I'm choking very hard right now. Oh no. A different gun. That's bad. I'm gonna lose my run. I'm gonna lose my run to this fucking to the unknown king.
Dude, who lied to me about the damage this gun, this gun does? It is jack shit. It is actually jack shit. Dude! I'm choking very hard right now. No! Wow, I've never thrown a run like that in my, so hard in my life. Dude, what the fuck happened? I fucking no damage killed this guy last time I did him, like two days ago. No! <sighs> I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry and I'm so tired and now I'm sweaty, chat, because I sweated. No, 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 no. <sighs> oh, I hit quick restart by accident. No, we don't want to do that. We don't want to do that at all. Dude, I've be I've fucking shit on Old King, but we get no happy music for this one. We get absolutely no happy music for this. <laughs> okay, we're moving exit into the gungeon, and I'm uh I'm instead putting in Wizard of Legend. Free me, free me. No more happy music. Wait a minute. Why is there an empty space? Why is there an empty space? No, 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 no. This does not count. This doesn't count. There's an empty space here for some reason. This does not count because it's an empty space. The odds. No, 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 no. The odds were messed up. No, 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 no. The odds were messed up because there's an empty space for no reason. No, 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 no. We're going again. It doesn't count. It does not count. It doesn't count. Slay the Spire. We're playing Slay the Spire. We're playing Slay the Spire. And there's, you can't stop this. Empty space. Yes, it does. The empty space does spell as the mods. You're dumb. You're dumb. You're dumb. You have no idea what you're talking about. Where's Slay the Spire? You have absolutely no idea. No, 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 no. Stay mad. That's all I have to say to you. Stay mad. Stay pissed. You know what? And you know what? You know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna hit you guys with an ad. I'm hitting you with an ad, too. That's right, boys. Stay pissed. I am in control here. You're not getting trolled. No, I did not cheat you out of shit. I didn't cheat you out of shit. I'm I'm in control here. Who's in control of the stream? Whose stream is this? My slave spire is not responding. Yeah, it doesn't it's not a hundred percent play chance to play an ad. It just happens sometimes. I didn't promise anything. This is just happening because I'm I have my my I'm like streaming the game. I'm like I'm like live streaming right now and it like freaks out. It'll work. There. Look, it worked. Show the non-believers. I don't know why it looks like this right now. I had to reinstall this game. That's probably why. Um, okay. I don't know why I didn't apply my settings. I don't know why it's not currently applying my settings. I have to quit out. Maybe I have to quit and come back in. Come on. I trust you. How would you feel about a 3D roguelike similar to Wizard of Legend? I probably would like it. You played Akamanto. I did. Maybe. I might have. Guys, it's okay. It's going to. It's. All right, guys, I got to go. Good luck, Jay. Please be this challenge because you suck and it's been four hours. It's not been f Has it been four hours? I started this stream at five o'clock and it's 8.30. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Man, I suck. Man, I suck, dude. <laughs> wow. 
I might have to go and just, like, eat dinner. You lied to all of us. I was here for four hours. I didn't lie. I didn't lie. You stepped up 4 a.m. for this? That's not my fault. You can leave. You can leave anytime you want. <laughs> I'm not holding anyone hostage. Oh. If I play the fucking... Too many games, I don't have time. Curse of the Dead, guys. I think I've played that. Hang on. What's left on this? What's left on this list? Gunfire Reborn, Noida, Frost and Light, Wizard of Legend, Exit the Gungeon. Jesus Christ. Honestly, I think Slay Spire is the one I have the best chance out of these ones. I think I, this is the one I have the best chance of winning. Jason Mountain Time, let's get him. <laughs> if I play Reverta, am I allowed to leave? If I play Reverta, am I allowed to go get food? Is that how this is going to work? We keep going until I win. It says it right here. Oh my god. Noida is a quick one you want. Yeah, no, I'm going to lose Noida though. I'm, I'm allowed to leave and go get food and, and end the stream and come back tomorrow if I get... If... <laughs> I'm only allowed to take a break? No, I'm allowed, to, I'm allowed to get off and then come back and finish this tomorrow. I've been sleeping till I win. Oh my god. You're not gonna. I'm allowed to take. I'm gonna take a food break whenever I want. But I'm. I think I'm. I think I'm allowed to. Uh, to. Uh, come come back tomorrow if I play the the one, fucking game of you guys, Ravita. I'll do. I'll do the Slay the Spire run first though. Okay. I'll do this. Um. Let's see. I want to go. Uh, oh, if I get lucky, I could do an elite. I can get an elite for free. If I do these three, I can go to the elite and get him at zero health for free. That could be good. I'll go this path. Easy. I want. Fuck, I don't even remember. I have not played this game in so long. Hundred seventy five gold? I'll take that. Obtain the idol, trigger trap. Image of twenty percent more gold, that sounds good. Come cursed with an injury, take 20 damage, lose 6 match HP. I'll take the 20 damage, I think. No, I shouldn't do that. That would be greedy. That would be greedy. Right? Check the map. Let me check the map here. What's my next heal? If I get lucky on this next question mark, I go to the elite. The elite won't heal me. Don't I have a relic that heals me? I heal 6 at the end of each. If I go here, then it would be a long time till my next campfire. And I want to upgrade a card to the campfire. Take the curse. <sighs> what run is this? This is four or five? Yeah, can I tell those of you sleeping? But I just took I just took a, a doubt though. I did I, I guess next some next shop I go to, I'll just like I'll have these removed. God damn it. Oh. Fuck! I should have just taken the... No! If I had known this. I should have just taken... I should have just taken the freaking... Damage. And then I could have got it healed instantly for less money. Oh well. Oh well. Oh, uh, only can be played every target is an attack. Deal 14 damage. Draw one card. Put a card from the top of your hand in the exhaust pile. Into the top of your draw pile. Ooh. Clash is good, I think. Only one card per shop? I didn't know that. Okay. Uh... 
Um, I think I take Clash, but Warcry sounds good too. Drawing cards is good. I'll take Warcry. I go this way, this elite will have one HP. Huge. Whenever you attain a curse, increase your match HP by six. That would have been nice earlier. You have four plated armor. Add a card to your deck. I can get Clash now. Lose three H six HP, gain two, draws three cards. Deal nine damage per card from top of your discord. Top of your draw pile. I just all passed up the class. I kind of want the clash now. Never played this before. Is it worth? Dude, I love Sly of Spire. It's a great game. I just haven't played it in a while. Take Offering. It's so good. I think Offering's good too. What have we here? You duck into a small hut. Inside you find what appears to be a forge. The smithy tools are covered in dust, but a fire roars inside its furnace. You feel on edge. Upgrade a card in your deck. Obtain a special relic. Become cursed with pain. And play whenever, when in hand. Lose one HP whenever you play another card. Starting your turn, upgrade a random card in your hand for the rest of the combat. Ooh. Or, uh, or just upgrade a random one. Let me look at my deck. What do I even upgrade? Probably offering. They did announce Slay this player too. Let's see, I think I'll probably upgrade offering. But will this make it? Draw five cards. That's like, that's just, you get a new hand. Like if you have a shit hand and you have this, that seems pretty good to me. Oh, I hate the cultists. They're so annoying. It's like you just get to take an extra turn, literally. One, two, this six HP. Gain two, draw five cards. I'll just do it now. There's no reason I shouldn't. One, two, three, four, five. I just need to like do damage to this guy. Cause he does this, he's gonna like give himself extra Attack. I need him to die quickly. Oh, I forgot you discard your entire hand after you use it. Okay, good thing is is that I got... Um... Uh, how much does defend do? Okay, I'll take the one damage here, I think. I'm okay with that, because I'm going to heal it all this back. At the end of the, at the, end of the combat, anyways. Um, uh, and then I should be able to just kill him. Good. I was able to kill him last turn, wasn't I? Shit, I could've... I could've not taken this one damage. Deal damage equal to your block. Deal two damage four times. Deal three damage to random enemy three times. I forgot about the Vron liberal. Yeah, you're right. Deal damage equal to your block. Hmm. Hmm. I prefer regular roguelikes, but I don't mind deck building roguelikes. Inscription and Slay the Spire are very fun. If you ever want to, I love to do the Japan video. If you want to visit Japan without the cleanliness, try China. I don't think I'll do that. Pummel is good if you get things that give you strength. Or plus, I have the, the ones that give you vulnerable, which are pretty good. Okay, which chest will I take? Hmm, I think I'll take this one. Because I want to get that fireplace anyways. Potions always appear in combat rewards. Okay. So I should be using a potion every round, essentially. I should smith. What'd this do? Two damage five times. That's two extra damage. In 13 block. Draw two cards. Yeah, bash plus might be good. Hmm. 
How did you get an opportunity to study in Japan and what uni college did you go to? Uh, I don't know if I want to say the name of the university I went to, um, but I just, there was a, a program with my school that I went through. I mean, I don't, I don't go to that university anymore. I guess, if, I don't know. I think, it, hmm. I don't go there anymore. It's not like you guys are going to go to the university and be like, hey, give me this guy's records. I'll think about it. I'll think about letting you know what the university I went to. You're physically trapped, bro. I'm literally doing the stream until I fucking win, the, win one of these. Three stacks of vulnerable to two is pretty big. I think that's good. Because it also, it also does the damage. It's damage plus extra vulnerable. That's a pretty good deal. And I should use one of these... Uh, potions. Because I'm guaranteed to get a potion every time. I should definitely use one of them. Um, two damage four times. Uh, I need to draw a card. Uh, that was not a good card to draw. Uh, yeah. That's not really what I wanted to draw. I think I would take the two damage four times. I said just do all three of these. So should I use four plated armor, draw three cards? Okay, here we go. That's what I needed. I think pummel this one. Does it lose this defense at the end of this turn? I think it does. And then some children take seven and six. So I should use my other defend first and block all of it. That's good to me. Six and seven again. I'll definitely bash. I'm definitely going to bash this one, and then I'll just strike that one. And then I'll use Offering. And... Should I bash it again? No, I should, I should def block the damage that's coming. And then I'll just hit him once. Wait, would that bash have killed him? Because he had the, the vulnerable? Fuck, he might have killed him. It's okay. It's dead anyways. Just took one extra turn. Speed potion. Gain five to center. Uh, improves the blocking from cards. Okay, that sounds pretty good. Draw one card, put a card on top of your hand. Uh, rapture whenever you lose HP from a card, gain one strength. And then you go to your block. This is first time playing Slayer Spire? Uh, no. Yeah, block always resets unless the enemy has a barricade buff. I haven't played in a while. I'm gay as hell. Congratulations, Raphael. I'm glad you came out here. Good for you. Um, how do you lose HP from a card game one strength? I only have one card that that works on. I'm thinking Body Slam, too. I'm thinking also Body Slam. You already have a synergy with Offering. I know. But it's only one of them. Some people are saying Skip. You guys are all telling me different things. The one thing I'm not hearing is War Cry, though. I think it's Body Slam, Rapture, or Skip. I think I might go with the Rapture. Rapture. Not Rapture. 
Uh, and then I guess... Ah, uh, I want to do the Elite, but I want to go to this shop. I have, I have a lot of money. I'll go here. Free chest. Let's go. The start of your second turn, gain 14 block. Not bad at all. Maybe a shop. Hello. This guy makes the funniest noises. Oh. Uh, shuffle three random skills into your draw pile that costs zero this turn. Panic button. Gain 30 block. You cannot gain block for cards for two turns. That's terrible. That's terrible, right? Switch combat with one strength. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that's pretty good. Whenever you enter rest site, enter the next combat with two extra uh, energy. Whenever viewing your draw pile, the cards are show now shown in order. Choose one of three random attack cards. Uh, ah. Deal three damage to a random enemy three times. Oh, isn't Palma Strike good? I remember Palma Strike being very good. But I'm thinking the artifacts might be good. Block whenever your attack is turned, deal four damage back. I'm sorry, I have 420. Yo, 420! Everyone get your weed. I'm thinking this thing. The dash? Vash? Vajra? That's not very family friendly. I think I got the extra strength. Vajra and Frozen Eye give you a good ah. shit. Vajra. Va Vaj Vajra. Vajra. Okay. This thing sounds good, and so does this thing. Okay, Shrug it off and is just is just the block version of Pommel Strike. Should I get the block instead? Maybe I should have gotten this. I'm three random skills into your draw pile because it's your this turn. Oh! The removal! Thank you for reminding me about that. Yeah, get rid of this thing. Okay. Three damage, four times, exhaust. Uh, I'll use this, because otherwise it's going to go away. And hit that guy one more time. Sweet. He's growing. Oh my god, he's gooning. This guy's going to goon too if I don't stop him. When you lose HP from a card, gain strength. Okay, play that. Because I got... I got offering coming up next turn. Uh, I could kill this one right now, uh, and I should do that because I'm already got my block. So I forgot I had the extra fourteen. Get the free fourteen damage. Yeah, so I'll play this. Now I do vulnerable. Uh, I'll draw a card. Mm. No. Put this on top. And then I just strike him twice. Okay. Good shit. Regen potion game. Five regen. Uh, I think the, these are better. And a card to your deck. Deal eight damage to all damage. Ooh, cleave is good, isn't it? Whenever a card is exhausted, gain three block. Or pummel again. I could get pummel again. Slay the Spire. This game is called Slay the Spire. When do we see the Slay the VTuber now? I see a slightly animated silhouette of a bird. <laughs> uh, do eight enemies damage to all enemies? I think it's that. I think it's that for sure. I 
And then I smith one of these. Cleave, perhaps? Ooh, or that. Eleven all enemies. Card draw's good. And cleave. There's gonna be yeah, the sequel to this got announced literally yesterday, so. I think two strength is good. Sequal, my spelling idiot. Eleven damage to any every enemy is like an insanely good deal <laughs> for one. I'll do that. All right, here we go. If you say the subscribe shill phrase on stream, will it play the fancy rainbow animation? That's a good idea. Subscribe. Did it go? Did it did it go? Did it work? We don't know if it worked. No, oh, unfortunate. Um, I think I don't know if I need to use this offering right now. I think I need to save this for when I'm in like a sticky situation, you know? Because otherwise it's going to get exhausted. Both of these will. Should I use Warcry and then put Offering on top of my, my draw pile for next turn? Subscribe. Subscribe. Did that work? Cards are drawn from the top at the start of each turn. So I'll get one, two, three, four. I'll get these. And then I, if I use the offering, then I'll be able to... So I'll get this one, two, three, four, five next turn. And then one and then, and then there will be one that and then I can get the five extra one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. So that I don't think it'll quite get me all of them. I won't be able to get to cleave. But I definitely I'll get rupture. But then I won't have ghostly armor, because it's gonna make me it's gonna force me to draw ghostly armor. Which I don't want to do, because I have to use ghostly armor, otherwise it gets exhausted. I'm just gonna end turn. I can full block this. Almost. Wait, I wanted to drink the dexterity potion, not the fucking plated armor shit. Whatever. Okay, in four, so I'll full block this, and then I'll use this. Should be good. Yeah. Okay. Fuck the negative debuff. Um, negates the next debuff. I should probably drink this because I don't want that. Um, uh, three damage four times. Cleave. Oh, shit. I suppose I didn't need to use that artifact thing, but I, I think the artifact stays. You attack. Whenever you play an attack, take three damage. That sucks. Um, nine. I need to drink the dexterity, otherwise I'll take damage. Where did my artifact go? 
My artifact gets negated if I use one of my own thing. That's lame. Uh, I should use my bash for sure. I'll take two here. Should I use this? Uh, do you think going on an exchange in Japan without knowing the Jap any Japanese will be a good idea or will they be suffering? It'll be a lot harder for you and it'll be a lot less fun if you don't know Japanese. I know a lot of people who spoke zero Japanese um, and went and they had a fine time. But I definitely, you don't get the full experience if you don't Japanese. I mean, there's plenty of English anywhere. It's like far, easy to get around. You'll make friends with other foreigners. So like, you won't be like lonely, I don't think. But speaking Japanese makes it so much more fun. Should I use this? Like, what do I have? Hmm, this is not worth using. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna one, two, three, four, five. Which gets me basically nowhere. Is Risk of Rain on the list? It is, what's the first one we did? Did you flex the move with using Artifact on a flex debuff? Eight times two. Uh, what's this? 16 says that'll be enough to block it. Draw one card. Um, put type of pile. I'd be drawing cleave, which is good, I suppose. If I do this, I'm gonna take. Th I'll get plus four, so that'll still be enough to full block. Uh. If I do, if I draw the card. Uh, then I'll be able to use Cleave this turn, but I'll take some damage. The alternative is using Cleave next turn. I have Dexterity permanently now. Even, like, next round? How do I still have 79 HP? Built differently. Love your game reviews. You should consider reviewing unblocked games. I'm not sure what that means. Have I played Dead Cells yet? Not this one. I think I'll just use Cleave next turn. I think I agree with you. I'll still full block this though, right? Are Japanese easy to approach? You mean Japanese people? I mean, everyone's different. Japanese people, listen, this is one thing that I, you have to kind of, I feel like you gotta kind of remind people about. They're not a hive mind, bro. You know? They're not all the same. I feel like people, a lot of the YouTubers, like, Japanese people are this, Japanese people are that. Dude, they're all different, you know? They're still people. They're not a hive mind. They don't all act the same exact way. There's plenty of, like, everyone's different, you know? On the whole, like, on in a, in a generalization, but yeah, they're a less extroverted, less outgoing than Americans. But so are, you know, British people are also less extroverted than Americans, you know? Um, put a card on top of your hand. Uh, I could draw a defense. That actually might be good. I may want to do that. I think I, I can use cleave, strike, a cleave, defend. And I need to draw another defense. So I'll put this top of the draw pile. I need that. Huge. Um, so to answer your question, are Japanese people easy to approach or hard to approach? Um, I'd say they're pretty, uh, for the most part, it's like anywhere else. Like they're, uh, there's at least some people who just don't want to talk to you. And I definitely had before. I was like, asking for directions in a train station and the person just like, just shook their head at me and like said, no. Um, and I was like, okay, whatever. They're just shy. It's fine. More power to you. It doesn't matter. Um, what happened to my draw? That's like a good chance to get some damage in if I use my offering. I don't really need this right now though. I'm just saving it for when I really, really need it. Um, but like, if, for the most part, if you if you have an issue and you need like help, they're pretty willing to help you. Um, 
Of the content, are you going to play Chinese Will Smith game Undone? No. I don't know what that is. I don't know what you're talking about. I think you might need help from a professional. Thanks for the five bucks, by the way. Um, yeah, it, honestly, Chinese people, they're, they're very, very kind. Um, for the most part. So just, like, if you have something, you just go up to them and be like, hey, what's up, dog? Bash. Here. Your little baby form. Fuck. This sucks. He's got all this defense. All this defense, but I can't... I can't do anything to it, so I might as well just... See, I've got to draw five cards. One, two, three. When I get Bash back? Are these going, do they go randomly? There's a chance I get Bash back. It's not, it's not even worth it, though, because I won't be able to get their shield. It, it wouldn't even matter. It wouldn't even matter. Keep track of when he's going to switch forms. Okay. I'll get on that. Uh, okay, in 10 block by doing this. I should use my block first because I'm going to take damage. I'll use my I'll use this. So I'll, I'll lose it if I don't use it. I'll do that. And that'll be enough to full block. Okay. Aren't you taking to become fluent in Japanese? At least be able to converse freely, rather freely on the screen. Uh, I'm glad you included the second part because... The funny thing about fluency is that there is no definition of fluency. No one knows what that means. Does fluency mean I can order pizza without having an issue? Who knows? Some people would say so. Does fluency mean I can uh, do a business deal without, you know, with fully in Japanese? Who knows? Does it mean I can just watch a TV show and understand everything? Like, yeah. There's no, like, definition of fluency, but some people, like, conversationally fluent is, like, a better... Uh, like measure of it. There's conversationally fluent, business fluent, native like fluency. Um, conversationally fluent, I'd say I was there at about like two and a half years. Like when I went to Japan, I had been studying it for like two and a half years. So I'd say I had a pretty decent grasp on the language at that point. Um, this sucks. I don't have any damage. I don't have any block. I should do bash and then do my defense. And I'll block most of it here. Um, I, when I got to Japan, it was like the first time I'd ever been to Japan, so I had to, it took me a little bit to kind of get my speaking ability caught up. Um, but then I'd say I was pretty fluent. Uh, I, right, as of right now, I think as of like, it's like April, it's actually like next week, like, I think it's like April 18th or something is like the three year anniversary of when I started learning Japanese. Um, I'm getting close to business fluency, I feel like, I'm, I'm working on it though. I gotta use Bash here, and I think this is the time to use Offering, because I don't have any block cards. I'll use Bash, and then I'll defend. I don't want to take 10 damage, so I'm going to use my Offering. Okay, I just got all of my defense cards. <laughs> my basic cards. Okay, cool. Full block. Unblocked games are games on a web browser that can be played from work or school. There's a huge variety. could be fun to record slash watch. Interesting. That's an interesting comment. That, and that's... The only issue with that is like, I don't know how. What do I what do I name that video? You know. How does the audience know what that means? Oh, I might as well use this. So I don't get, don't lose it. You know, how do I like name title the video so people understand what the kind of game it is? Like what an unblocked game is? Because I have to. Because I have to. People don't know what that is typically. So I think in the title or something, I have to explain what it is, which is tricky. Looking four here. I should do. Uh, I'll do one block and I'll do bash, and I'm gonna take some damage here. Just one health. Why didn't I just just fucking bash and then strike him? I'm so stupid. Whatever, it doesn't matter. He's dead. Good job, boys. We lost twenty health there. 
two energy out of card to your deck. And break. Double your strength. Exhaust. Skills cost zero whenever you play a skill. Exhaust it. Uh, this turn, your next attack is played twice. You were the longest game in order to avoid playing Ravia, didn't you? That's not even my... That's not even... That's not even possible. How did I... How did, it's a fucking random number generator, bro. For example, uh, would there be certain behaviors that Japanese would find weird if you weren't close friends with them or even those behaviors are normal outside of Japan? Uh, okay. What am I... Oh, sorry. I gotta pick one of these cards first. Double your strength, exhaust. This turn, your next attack is played twice. Corruption skills cost zero when you play skill exhausted. I think double tap sounds good. Go for that. Proceed. Not getting my item. Gain. Uh, and now, oh, I start with an extra. When you ever open a non-boss chest, obtain a curse. Ooh. Gain energy at the start of your turn. All enemies start combat with one strength. Elites drop an additional remical when defeated. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I like starting with extra energy. That's pretty good. I think... Oh, fuck, I want to... <sighs> You're taking, you say take Black Star, but I really want the car's key. But I want the extra, and fine, I listen to you. I trust you. Okay, so I should be playing to get as many elites as possible now then. So I need to go for this elite. How much money do I have? Should I go for this shop? I don't have enough. Elite here. And then elite here. So as long as I go for this one, any path I choose will lead me to at least one elite. Should I go for the, the two question marks? I usually like the question marks. I go question mark, question mark, shop, elite. Sounds good to me. Or if I go here, I could go one, two, three combats to the shop. That might be a good... Uh, question about Japan. Um, are the oh fuck! I hate this enemy. Uh, what was it again? I don't remember. Hang on, look, look. Uh, for example, are there certain behaviors that Japanese would find weird if you weren't close friends with them? Even those numbers are considered normal in Japan. There's a million of those things. Are you kidding me? Okay, it's lucky we started with cleave. Yeah, there's so many things you have to be careful about. Um, there's a little bit of. They don't like. They don't tend to like rag on each. Oh, fuck! I should have played my, my block, my ethereal. Oh, shit, that sucks. I should have played that block. It wasn't worth the extra. I'm gonna gain fourteen. Here, though. Okay, that's good. Do three damage, four times, exhaust. Ooh, that'll kill one of these. That'll take him out of the sky, at least. Very good. Sweet. A block, two times five, ten. So I'll full block this. Kill him while he's down. He's getting close. Still stunned. Uh, I, yeah, so, I don't know. In English, like, speakers, or Americans, or whatever, we like to kind of, like, um... I don't know. You kind of give each other shit a lot. Um, I don't know. Like, respectfully. I, I don't know. You know, it's like you kind of like rag on each other a little bit. And it's like, it's funny. It's like a joke. Um, they're not as into that in Japan. Um, oh, I should have played that first. Whatever. Um, I need defense right now. And I think I should probably use Offering because I don't need more defense. So otherwise, I'm going to be taking 15 damage here. And that kind of sucks. Or one card. Uh, yeah. Okay. 
I got one more defense. This sucks. Um, what's all I gotta do? I could bash, strike, energy potion, strike, strike, and kill one of them to reduce my damage. Bash, strike, energy potion, strike. I won't do damage now, so I could block, and then I'll full block. Good. I could have used the bubble top. I forgot about that. That would have been perfect, too. How's Japan in terms of racism? I don't know what your race is. I'm white. Um, Japanese racism is extremely over-exaggerated, dude. It's, it's such a... Like, it's so non-existent, bro. Or, like, at least to the level that people say. Um... A lot of it... And I, and I really... I genuinely believe that most of the, the people that think that they think that because they don't speak Japanese and they don't understand things that are going on. And so their brain starts to make up shit, you know, like, cause you get, you get stared at a little bit in Japan as a white person. And I think people who don't speak Japanese and they don't understand like what's going on or they, you know, they take that as they're staring at you cause they think you're weird and they don't like you and they want you to leave or go home or whatever. And that's just not true. It's just not, um, Sucks. I'm gonna take fuck. I'm gonna take ten damage here. I'm gonna use one health. Um, yeah. I mean, the the staring is it's uh, it's not. What is this? Metal eyes? I don't know what that is. Flex is good, right? We want flex or clash plus. Flex is good, right? Am I crazy? 18 damage, though. 18 damage. Metalize is like plated armor? Okay. I think I'm on flex. I think I'm on flex. Um, yeah, so the reason that you get like stared at in Japan as a white guy or whatever. Remove a card from my deck. What card would I want to remove? I don't particularly want the strike. I could remove a strike, I guess. I think 75 is a lot for card removal. I think no. Uh, okay, yeah. So the reason you get started on Japan is not because they want you to leave and they hate you and they don't they don't like you or whatever. It's they're it's curiosity. It's so much of it is is curiosity. Um, ooh, ooh, that could be good. Uh, it's curiosity. Like they just they're like, oh my god, there's a foreigner here. Like that's cool. Like, or um, like I. I wonder what he's doing. Like, they just want to know, you know? Oh, they're, like, surprised that you're in that area. Um, and and you, I think it, it's... It, especially, you'll notice that, like, if you go up and talk to one, uh, like, someone, or, like, you say hi to them, like, instantly you can tell. You'll you'll know, okay, it was not racism. They just, they just want to know. They're just curious about why you're there. Um... um I think I might do this. This sounds good. I'm pretty good at negating the damage, I think. And that's better than strikes. Um, this has all been a fucking tangent. I, just, I need to finish this. I need to finish this fucking thought about the racism thing so I can move on from it. I've been talking about this for like five minutes because I, I can't finish the fucking thought. I, I get getting distracted. If you, go, if you go up to someone and you talk to them, you'll realize like instantly, oh my God, they just wanted to talk to me because they're curious. And they'll ask you all these questions about like where you're from. Oh my gosh, you speak Japanese. Oh my God, it's so cool. But if you never speak Japanese, you never come to that realization because you never talk to them. You know, so you, your brain like starts, you're just like making shit up. Like, oh my God, they must be racist. They must hate me. Uh, and they, they say like things like that. There's so many misunderstandings that happens when you don't speak the other person's language. It's a million of them. So you're really, if you speak Japanese, I really don't think it's that much of an issue. Um, and the, uh, the race, uh, the racism thing, like you take your, your 
brother got made fun of in Korea because they were Chinese. Bro, that's there's bad apples in every country. Like that'll happen to you in America. That'll happen to you in Canada. That'll happen to you in every country. That happened, like, you know, that there's there's weird people in every country. Like one time, yeah, I got my, I went to a, my sister came to visit me when I was in Japan over Christmas. She came to visit me uh, and we went to a place and the, the English menu they gave us was more expensive than the Japanese menu. And I was reading it. And I was like, hey, what's going on with this? They're trying to scam us because we were, they thought we were dumb foreigners, dumb, dumb foreign tourists. But that happens in every country. That's literally every single like tourist place on the earth will have people trying to scam you. You know, it's, I don't think that Japan is more racist than any other country. I really don't. Um, now that being said, their politicians, they're all those fuck politicians, racist as fuck. They hate foreigners. They hate them so much. <laughs> um, it, for dumb reasons too. It's very annoying. Okay. I'm done with the fucking racism point now. We're done. We're over that. Uh, okay. The 10 damage, if fatal, raise your max HP by three. Exhaust. That could be good. Uh, oh, armaments is good, isn't it? And especially if you, if you, um... What should we call it? Uh, if you upgrade that, because it upgrades like all the cards in your hand. If you if you if you like forge that one, at start of each combat, play one vulnerable to all enemies. Start of each combat. Uh, okay. This thing feed and whirlwind. Whirlwind can't be good. I don't know if I trust you on whirlwind. I think I like armaments better. Armaments is common. You'll see it again. You don't think it's worth 47? Rowan doesn't seem good to me. Did you meet Yakuza? I did not meet one, but I definitely saw some. Is it true that uh, Japanese are heavily inspired by American themes? Do you notice any stuff like that there? Yeah, so anything that's popular in America will become popular in Japan in three years. That's the rule. <laughs> um, when, fuck. Fine. Fine. I trust you with world runs. I find trust you. Um, they do like American stuff a lot. Um, oh, fuck. I forgot to tell you guys my funniest story about the staring thing in Japan. One time I went to... Hang on. I'll pull it up. I'll pop the picture. Um, Todaiji. This temple. I went to this temple with my Korean friends. Um, this is in Nara. Yeah. Dude, this was the funniest fucking shit ever. I went here with my Korean friends. Uh, and they don't speak any English. Uh, my Korean friends, and we had one other American, but he's half American, half Japanese. So we spoke Japanese too. So we we're speaking in Japanese the whole time. And there was a group of, um, of high school students here. On like a, a, a trip, like a, it was like, it must've been like a whole, like two or three classes. It was like, it was a lot of people. It was like, it was like 30 or 40, like high school students. They were all like wearing their uniforms or whatever. And we're speaking in Japanese. And because we're in Osaka, Osaka speaks a very, very distinct, distinct dialect. And I'd been there for a while and all my friends spoke Osaka dialect. It's, it's very, very different from regular Japanese. Most like foreigners don't, they don't speak Osaka dialect. It's, very, it's pretty rare to speak Osaka, Osaka dialect. But I speak Osaka dialect because that's like where I was and everyone spoke Osaka, Osaka dialect. And so all of me and like my, my Korean friends were all speaking Japanese. I'm speaking in Osaka dialect. And literally, I don't think these, this group of high schoolers had ever seen a foreigner speak Japanese in their life, let alone Osaka dialect. I think they were from like the countryside because every single one of them, like, this is like 40 people, all of them like in a circle staring at me. It was so funny. That was definitely the worst I ever had the the staring thing. That was weird for me. That was pretty funny though. Um and that was that was another one of the things where I was like these guys definitely aren't like, you know, they're like high schoolers. They don't give a shit that I'm you know, they're not like they're not like, "Oh my god, get out of the country." They were just like flabbergasted that I was speaking this like uh, this dialect with my friends like you know and not speaking anything else it was that was hilarious i, I did like a 360 and looked all of them in the eyes at one point it was so funny uh okay i bashed this guy you know with that um definitely should use double tap first what am i doing what am i doing pro and i just i misplayed the shit out of that what am i doing i could have double tapped him tw Wow. That was um that was bad. 
I apologize for that. That was embarrassing. Okay. <sighs> okay, here we go. Is it hard to learn Osaka dialect after learning Japanese? No, it's it didn't take me long to pick it up. I already knew how to understand, like, I because I knew I was going to go. I knew about it. I knew I was going to go to Osaka, so I, like, studied it a little bit. Um, but a dialect isn't, like, something you do intentionally. It's something you kind of, like, pick up. But I knew how to understand it before I went. And then everyone was speaking... Um, everyone was speaking Japanese or Osaka dialect, and I just kind of slowly started using it, too, and now it's all I speak. Six, I could do six times. No, I need, to, I need to block this for sure. Should probably use that. I kind of want to save it for my next one, though. Um, I definitely need ghostly armor here. Um... Dude, this freaking the frail thing is so frustrating. No one card. What I draw? Uh, it's kind of a gamble on what I'm gonna draw here. Deal eight damage, heal two HP. That could be good. Draw one card, put it on the top of your hand, on the top of your draw pile, exhaust. There's a chance that it'll be a block card, and I can get some of that out of it. If not, I guess there's not really much of a downside to doing this. Yeah, it's, yeah. Give me the, just give me this next turn. I might as well do that, and I'll get two, two back. Um. Uh, how was it find a place to live? It was pretty easy because my my school gave me suggestions on places that I should apply for, and I just picked one of those. Um, like, I, I was allowed to do the dorms, but the dorms had, like, these weird rules. There was, like, a, there's so many rules in those dorms. It was really weird. Um, so I chose not to go to the dorms. I, I do bash. I think I do bash? That'll be 13. Uh, or should I full block? I think I should full block and then use bite. I can't full block. I just remember it because it's a stupid freaking frail thing. Whatever. He's gonna defend himself again. Don't defend yourself. How much you? Fifteen. Okay, I should use double tap, cleave, ghostly armor. Four. Wait. And he's dead. Sweet. Armaments plus, right? This is good. I take this right. Yes, 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 yes. How's the street food entertainment, by the way? It's awesome. It's incredible. Especially um, because Osaka is like the best place for street food. Um, is is depending on the Asian country you visited. I went to Korea briefly as well. hate this encounter. You should definitely use Armaments Plus, right? Always use that. Nine damage to three HP. I have to use that. 12 plus three. Double your block. Ooh. Um, ooh, I think the shockwave is better. And then I use this to heal. Yes. Maybe I should use my other potion. Take five. 
Uh, okay. Um, I'm gonna need to use this. Uh, double tap. Next text, but mm, need a block really. There's fast mode in the settings. What is that? Okay, I trust. I think defend. I, oh, I have fourteen. I just forgot about that. I wish I would like summarize all the damage you're gonna take. Nine plus nine plus six, fifteen. So I'm gonna take twenty damage here. I need to block. F oh, I'll, I'll have an, actually I'll block exactly enough. This is perfect. Uh, double tap, and then use uh, two. Sheesh. Uh, flex, cleave. Ooh, flex, ooh, flex, rupture offering, cleave. Ooh. Now you cleave. You know, dig for relics at rest sites. Okay. Uh, pocket watch. Well, when you play three or less cards during your turn. And we got feed. Good fight, baby. That's what I'm saying. Whenever you play three or less cards during your turn, draw three additional cards to start the next turn. Okay. Deal 20 damage. Uh, and block one card. Gain seven block. Exhaust one card at random. This is terrible. It's just an objectively worse version of this one. Drukid is terrible. Why is that in the game? That's such a terrible card. Holy shit. Uh, I think I shrug it off. Shrug it off or skip? I might skip. Okay, it's going to sound like I just I copied what you just said in chat. Shrug it off or skip. Um, but I promise I said that before I read your message. If I upgrade Drukid, it would make it not random. But I don't... But I don't really care that it's random. I just don't want to exhaust a card. That's not good. Oh, exhaust synergy. Okay. Um, I might just skip it. I might have... Do I have an issue with blocking? It's plus it's card draw, too. Okay. I guess I'll do that. I need to stop taking cards, though. Uh, I hate this encounter. Uh, I'll draw Pummel if I use this. Might be good. Uh, but I think two attacks and a block is good as well. I think I should maybe use my offering, but I don't want to use my offering until I use rupture. Let's do any act two fight. Oh, I hate this encounter so real, dude. That's every. I, I, I might have said that every single time. Um, yeah, I will get whirlwind and double tap if I if I use offering now. I think I might be the play. Is there any way I can get... Now what is my next one? Cle Four times six. That's a lot of damage. But should I maybe use one defend to reduce the amount of damage I'm taking? It might be good to do one defend. Come on. Oh, that's right. This hits twice. Wait. Six times four is 20. Oh, okay. So it is 40. Okay. Okay. okay, okay. Mm, you think I can tank it? Yeah, because I have a bite. I'll, I'll try to use as many bites as I can for the rest of the combat. Dude, imagine if I had my... 
Oh, I got my feed soon, too. I should keep her alive until I get my feed back, shouldn't I? I can I can keep him alive and not use that just yet. Um I should just try to do damage to him. But I don't want to kill her cuz I'm going to get my my feed next turn. Oh, she's going to heal herself. You're right. Should I just cleave it then? No, I should I should bite her. Bite her for the extra heal back. And then shrug it off. Do that. I don't need to shrug it off. I'm going to have to play it. I want that next turn for sure. Um, I should bite her and take that. And I guess just cleave. Yeah. It's gonna give me ghostly armor, which I want next turn, not this turn. Uh, so I might as well use this, I guess. There's nothing else I should really do. Uh, okay, so let's do 11. So use bash and then feed. Your potion. Whenever card is exhausted, gain four block. Oh, that's the synergy. Seeing red's pretty good. Five block, five damage. Feel no pain plus. When things are four block. Uh, I think I'm gonna take seeing red. Which path takes me to the next elite? This one takes me campfire plus elite. This one also does. This path is chest, campfire, campfire, elite. Versus chest. Okay, definitely chest, campfire, campfire, elite, right? There's no way that's not the optimal strategy. Oh, yeah. Chest, campfire, campfire, elite, for sure. Okay, uh, play. Uh, okay, I, I can get double tap if I use my offering. Uh, I should definitely block this, though. Um. Ten, seven times three, 14 plus seven is 21. Um. So defend again would be wise. Receiving attack damage gains three blocking. Okay, so definitely uh, defend, double tap, world defend, double tap, warband. Yes, that sounds correct. Uh, no, shrug it off. Double tap, whirlwind. Ooh. Very nice. Okay. Fear po- Oh, you're right. I should have done the fear potion. Uh, armaments. Uh, bite. Uh, I could do bite, fire potion. Uh, so far, so. Fuck, I should do the vulnerable first. And I could do the fire potion. Uh, so that'll make it do 30. 30 plus 13. I could kill now, right? Vulnerable. 
Fire potion. Potion is not affected by the other potion. Okay, I didn't know that. Save scum? You reckon I should You should you reckon I should go back to this the start of the save? For this round? That feels wrong. That feels wrong. Japanese war culture is bad as it's reported. Yeah, funny story about that. I'm not going to save scum. I don't think I want to save scum. That feels a little bad. Uh, funny story about the war culture. I was in downtown Osaka. This was like mid-October. Um, okay, so I'll go see armor for sure. Defend. Sing red. Uh, seems fine to me. Fuck. Not good. This is not good. Flex nine times two is enough to kill you. Okay. I start of your car, lose one HP and draw one card. The end of your turn, lose one HP and deal five damage to all enemies. Oh, I could have, you're right, I could have blocked a, I should have blocked, it. that would have been smart. That would have been smart. We're saying skip. Um, okay, funny story about the uh, the work cultures. I was in, this is like mid October. I was downtown Osaka with one of my Japanese friends, and I was like, kind of like, I was like, man, this is pretty cool. Like, there's a lot of like weird alleyways. People are saying skip. I think I clutch is good though. Whatever, I trust you. Uh, chest here. Uh, let me finish my thought. Fuck. Uh, we were like, there's a bunch of like weird, like kind of sketchy looking alleyways in Osaka, but they're all like, Osaka is like, has a reputation for being slightly more dangerous than the rest of Japan. It's like, it's like, it's like barely more dangerous than like any other city in, in, in Japan. And it's still like le leagues better than any American city. Um, and I was like, kind of like going to my, talking to my friend, I was like, yeah, it's pretty cool that we can just kind of like walk down these alleyways and like not fear for our lives. It's kind of cool. That it's like, it's so safe. And he was like, yeah, but do you know why it's so safe? Uh, and I was like... No, why, why, why is it so safe? And he told me, like, look up at the buildings, dude. Uh, like, all the big skyscrapers. And he's like, dude, the lights are still on. It's 10 o'clock at night. They're still in there working. And I was like, dude, that's crazy. I never realized it worked like that. The reason, like, a huge reason, like, that it, it's still so, like, it's so safe for Japan is because people are working until, like, 10, 11 at night. Those, like, last trains are always full, bro. Those last trains are always full because of people working till midnight. That like kind of that opened my eyes a little bit for sure. That kind of made me go, yeah, like damn. Uh, I think s seeing red upgrade would be good. Yes. I mean, the, the reason it's that it's more safe is because there's always people watching out, you know? If people are in there, like, working until 10, 11 at night, they're always, like, you know, kind of watching. They're always keeping an eye out, and there's always, like, witnesses everywhere, you know? Yeah, now you know what the lights in Tokyo really mean. Exactly. It's, it's, it's weird. I think I'll do f seeing red. This is just good, right? This is, this is for free. Two extra power for free. Or will run plus. Or double plat plus. So don't go to Tokyo. I mean, that's every major city in Japan. It's pretty pretty similar. Like Kyoto, um, Kyoto's the same way. Osaka's the same way. Um, Kobe was the same way. It's a little depressing. You guys think double extra double tap? This is good. This is like objectively very good though, right? 
Also, I could... I could also dig and find a random relic. Have you guys considered this option yet? Check back sitting so hard, man. We have to win this game. We have to win this game. We have to win this game. See, I I know there's like there's like two experts in the chat that are helping me. I don't know if I trust anyone else. Fuck! There's like ah oh, now it's confl now it's conflicting opinions. Now I don't know. Now I don't know. Fuck! 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 Rest could be useful. Fucking that's someone else brought up the rest. Somebody else brought up the rest thing. I would, I would benefit from from twenty. I trust. I trust. I trust. I trust. I'm gonna have another one in like two seconds, anyways. Ah, Sneko. Dude, this is literally every encounter on on the second stage is is, is annoying. All of them are so annoying. Uh, if I used War Cry, what I get? Okay, I'm just gonna one of those. Sneko. War Cry. Give me. Work hard would just give me an extra bite, which I guess is good. I don't have power to fucking play that. What am I doing? I'm so stupid. When you draw a card, randomizes cost. Oh, okay. It's kind of funny. A little bit silly. Um. I can full block here, and I... <laughs> two for two. That'd be funny. Uh, I guess i just do that. Good thing I got a bunch of damage out before he did that to me. Bastard. Free pummel. Free bash? It's not bad. Free bash, we take those. Um... Free pummel. We take that too. Should I upgrade all these cards? Probably would have been better to do before using the bash. Um, I need to definitely defend. It would be wise to take the offering, I think. Double tap, Sag. This sucks. Mostly armor, I think. 13 block is good. Now pummel. Now 9 times 3 kills him. Yes, 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 yes. No, I can't do math. He has 3 health left after this. Oh, I had strength. I forgot. You have a 20% of your max HP. That's pretty good. I'm going to just use that now. Good shit. Oh, Heavy Blade's good. Deal 14 damage. Strength affects his card three times. Uh, I should skip, right? I have too many cards in my deck. I should skip. AoE cards don't calculate the vulnerable damage all the time. It's a little weird, yeah. I know Heavy Blade is great, but I have too many cards. Yeah. Think about the double tap. Now nah, you're right, but I don't need it. What's this game called? This game is called Slay the Spire. Should I dig now? 
Or should I go for the seeing red? Or. Or. Hmm. I'm going to get a, a relic from this next boss anyways, so. We have two actually here. Whenever you receive attack damage from this enemy, add a wound into your part. That's annoying. Uh, I got whirlwind. Can I get double tap if I do this? I cannot. Uh, what is my? What did I get? You can do six times two. I kind of need some block cards. I ain't even gonna lie to you. It might be good to use this just to get some block cards. use two of these and then I should use whirlwind three times nine 27 where should I use bash bash plus bite would do 19 and give him vulnerable and I wait for the whirlwind to come back up I think this is probably the smarter idea how did you handle homesickness over there? I got literally no zero homesickness, bro. I think there was there was one day when I was I kind of missed like some of my friends, but I just called them. I just like call I just like called my friend and I was like then it was okay. <laughs> um Um, I'll just, I think shrug it off. What was this giving me? Shrug it off will give me cleave. Uh, I think I can shrug it off, double tap, pummel. And then potentially... Yeah, shrug it off, double tap, pummel. Seeing red cleave. Wait, did I do that wrong? Did I calculate this route wrong? Wait, this is nothing. This just this just puts me exactly where I was before. I experienced culture shock. Obviously, I did that. Okay, that wait. What is the value of this? This puts you in the exact same situation that you were at before, right? Minus one, plus two. No. Because this will... Yeah, so no, I should use this. Because then I'll, I'll get... Th I'll get three times four, which is like 12. No. Yeah, three times four is 12. Times two is 24. So that'll give me 24. Plus... 24. It'll be 48 damage here. If I use seeing red. I see no reason to save this. That looked like pretty good to me. Is there any rogue like I recommend? Uh, it's Streets of Rogue, super underrated game, which wouldn't be surprised if you hadn't heard it before. It's like real light beast GTA. Sounds sick. I think I just healed the exact amount that he damaged me for. Uh, okay, armaments plus for sure to upgrade all of these. Actually, most of them are upgraded. I'd only be upgrading flex, defend, and bite. Oh, I have double tap. Uh, flex, double tap, whirlwind. I need to, no, I need to. I need to block as well. Flex double tap whirlwind will get me uh, nine times two. Eighteen. Plus I. I have the strength, so I would take. No, I would take. 
I would take a 24 there. That's not good. I definitely need to use my ghostly armor here. I think I could use armaments. Armaments, ghostly armor, defend. Because otherwise I'm, I'm going to take a lot of damage here. Flex double tap kills, bro? What are you talking about? He's got 65 health left. What? Flex double tap world. How? Oh, because I get the strength from this. I didn't, I didn't factor that in. Okay, so which one of you motherfuckers lied? I trusted you. I trusted you fuckers. It, I trusted you fuckers. What have I done? I trusted you! Okay, that's what I get. That's what I fucking get for trusting Twitch chat. YouTube chat. Literally never gonna happen again. I never trust you fuckers again. I think I die. I just a run for that, I think. I actually think I lost a fucking run for that. Nah. Nah, wait a minute. I literally lost the run for that, I think. Eight plus five. Thirteen. I need to block. I need to block 30. <sighs> I need to block 30. Eight plus five, and I would draw a bite. Um, but I wouldn't use it. I'd just use the bite plus, probably. So I'd block 13. That would leave me... 30 minus 13. Uh, 17. 26 minus 17. That would leave me at, like... the next healing station at? Fuck. It's for a while. Use bite plus and give me the three health there. So I think it's a little bit, I guess. So I have 12. And I can gain some back by killing him with feet here. The start of each combat with 10 block. Question card. Future card rewards have one additional card to choose from. Swift potion, draw three cards. Um, gain seven block, deal seven damage. Uh, deal, deal three damage to a random enemy three times. I did not go to the Logan Paul Suicide Forest. I did not do that. I think Iron Wave Plus could maybe? Damage to a random enemy three times. I think that's good. Okay, and you just confirmed what I was thinking. Upgrade all strikes and defends. I don't have any strikes, but I could upgrade all my defends. Or remove a card. I don't really want to remove any of these particularly. We have to rest, which is unfortunate. Alright, good luck to us, boys. Who knows what he'll do. Uh, flex, cleave, pummel, shrug it off gives me war cry, which gives me bite. And then I would guarantee myself a block if I did this. I could also draw three if I wanted. One, two, three. That would give me seeing red, which would give me 
Nothing that good. I should just end the turn there, I think. Whatever, put the block on. Yep, we did it. When is the final boss? I have to do one more set. I'm fucking hungry, bro. This game takes forever. Your Japanese friends know Logan Paul? Yes, they know Logan Paul. Uh, okay. Warcry gives me bite. Um, I could do Warcry to get bite. Eh, this is not great. And I could do so. I could do Warcry to get bite, and then do Iron Wave to get one, two, three. Or sorry, I just use my switch, po switch potion to get that. Fourteen. I'll block. I'll full block all this damage. That's the good news. I'll do this. I will take. Uh, I'll take this next turn. That sounds good. red okay now double tap whirlwind yes Ah, double tap, seeing red. Whirlwind. <laughs> My secret fuckers combo has been finally released upon the world. Just did half of his health and killed all of his minions in one go. We take it. That was good shit. That was good shit, bro. Um, 21... I won't be able to full block here. No, I will be able to. There you go. Whirlwind is good. You're correct. My bad. I apologize for doubting the whirlwind. The power of whirlwind. Uh, I think bash, iron wave. Or... Uh, not bash. Bite, I think. Good. You are mine. What are you doing to me? Stop. Oh my gosh. Uh, flex, double tap, whirlwind. Uh, they're gonna be 16. Yeah, flex, double tap, whirlwind. Ah, uh, I should use the ghostly armor because I'm gonna lose it if I don't. Eight times two is 16. I don't want to lose my whirlwind. Or my ghostly arm. I don't want to, I don't want to lose this. I'm thinking... Ah, fuck. I think ghostly armor... Both of them are cleave? If you have them below half, you don't need it. Uh, you're right. Eight times two. Okay. Okay. Enter in. This is huge. Holy shit, he's still going. I'm still going, baby. This is the last time I do it for fucking years, though, by the way. Armaments. Defend. Uh, oh my god, am I dead? That's unlucky. These fuckers do so much damage. I just lost. 31 plus... He's doing 50 damage to me. I lost. Okay, well, GG.
No. <sighs> we made the deal. We made the deal. I'm going to lose this. And I have to play the shit game that everyone keeps telling me to fucking play. Or I save scum and we go back and we do it again. We do it all over again. Mm -hmm. Well. GG. We'll do the fine. Well, I'll take the fucking deal. I'm taking the plea deal. The fuck is the name of the game you guys need me to play again? Uh, Rev Ravita. Ravita. I'm pulling up Ravita. I'm buying it right now. I'm buying it right now. Chill out. Okay, fucking needs my credit card. One sec. This isn't showing my screen. My screen. My screen. Okay, thank God. Okay, I have it on the BRB screen. Okay. I don't need you guys see my fucking last four digits of my credit card. Can you imagine that shit? <sighs> okay, so the plea deal is that I get to go to sleep. Um, the plea deal is that I, I, I get to... I play this game that everyone wants me to play, and I get to go to sleep. I'm taking the plea. I'm taking the plea. Okay, it's, no, it's installing. I'm taking the plea. It is installing. There we go. That's the noise that the thing games make when they install. Yep, and I'll be back tomorrow, I suppose. And then never again. And then I never stream ever again. You guys get no streams for the rest of my life. Sound good? Sound good? Everyone okay with that? Hey, Joe, can I have mod? Oh, fuck. My bad. You're supposed to be modded. <laughs> Is that the pings that I have on Discord? Is that what they are? No, it's not. Okay. If you have a regular upload schedule, I do not. Confirm. Fix the fucking settings of the screen. Main menu, please. No, don't put me in a cutscene right away. I'm going to skip it. Main menu, please. Settings, video and audio, full screen on, resolution, and 201080. We're still on the wrong screen, my bad. We're back, here we go. Uh, am I supposed to play this game with a... Controller? Is it recommended with controller?
Ticking tower top. Okay, how do I attack? Attack button where? Okay, this is the tutorial. This isn't the actual game yet. Everyone, everyone chill out. Right here, pass the tutorial. And then do like one run and probably die. Okay, you can go on the edge of the walls. That's interesting to know. Yeah. If you don't beat the game, you gotta buy the plushie. What? No. That's not how that works at all. I see. You're not even playing the game? What do you mean? I am playing the game. This is what the game is. Okay. That's not working. Oh, a dash? Okay. Oh, that's shift! In what universe is that fucking... That doesn't look like shift at all. I thought it was the up arrow. Oh, okay. Now I can attack, though. Cool. Dash current side firms. Okay, it's a dodge roll. I got it. Okay. I like that it's fast paced. Ooh, I can offer my hearts. That seems good. Get all of them. That's kind of interesting. Okay. Oh, I can still gain the hearts back, though. I don't know how frequently you get healed in this game, but I'll assume it's. If it's allowing me to offer three hearts, I'm assuming I get healed pretty quickly. Okay, so you can... We're just Q. Okay, I can convert it into health. Okay, good shit. If I ever played Splunky, I have. I don't. I, I like. I refunded it though. Um, not because I didn't like it, just because I did it. I bought it for the last time I did this kind of stream, and then I just didn't get around to playing. I was like, I should probably refund this because I'm not gonna play it for a while. I liked it though, and I intend to probably buy it again eventually. Uh, There's another controversial gaming opinion that I have. Uh, I skip a lot of dialogue. Like, almost every time I see dialogue, I skip it instantly. My assumption is that I, by default, probably won't care about the story of the game. It's kind of a bad habit. Unless I'm playing a game that I like know is about story specifically, and that I'm I bought like specifically for a good story. What the fuck just happened to me? What just happened to me? I just suddenly was not able to move and lost all my health. That was cool. Let me out. Let me play. I don't care. I don't care. Let me play. Okay. Uh, how do I go back and do the roguelike? How do I start the next the next run? I've talked this fuck. How do I do the next run? I'm pissing off so many people. I already know I'm pissing you guys off. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, next run, here we go. This is an actual one now, I'm playing an actual run now.
Dude, fuck, I can't wait for the, the, the new uh, Game Boy that Games for Celeste to come out. I'm looking forward to that shit for, like, a lot. Um, this is, like, one of my favorite games ever. I fucking love Celeste. Prison key. Damage up. Shit. Okay, so if I beat this in, like, one go, what do you guys give me? I think I get $20 Super Chats. Just saying. How do, I re how do I regenerate the health again, Q? Oh, fuck. I guess you need to do it twice to get the full... Need two bars to get our full uh, heart. You beat him one go, you buy the push for you. I like that deal. Sounds good. You're talking to the gaming master. You're talking to him. I'm him. This won't be a problem. Glazing Grove? What? Alright, here we go. Poison enemies can contract dash. Duration 3 seconds. Enemies freeze surrounding enemies on death. Chance to shoot in 4 directions. That's 30%. Now, I should be able to grab another heart. No, I don't have quite enough. But you're one shot now. That's fine. I don't make mistakes. I don't get hit. Famous last words? Nope. <sighs> We're fine. You guys realize who I am, right? I'm the Stellar J. I don't make this. Oh, fuck. Um, I skip frames. I skipped the frame. My bad. I'm a guy getting ready to get ready to buy plush or something. This guy's only shoot horizontally. Okay, that's good to know. This gives me a bunch of, um, the ghosts, right? Yeah. And what does we have here? Upgrade one relic of the blackness for free. Okay, cool. Should I wait to, until it's, like, two hearts full? Or should I just use it now? I think I'll just use it now. What have we here? Oh, hello, sir. Give half a heart for increase my damage multiplier. Hmm. Hmm. Critical hits have a ch higher chance of occurring and increased luck, but increased damage. Hmm. Take this. Only five percent. That doesn't seem worth half a heart, my guy. I'm fighting for my fucking life out here. My fucking life again. This guy's gonna rip me off of half a heart. I don't know if I want that. Easy. So 
Oh, here. Use a key to get to the chest. Of course I will do that. Half a heart for the chest. I'll take it. Uh, familiar that bounces around the room and reflects enemy bullets on contact. Okay. That's good enough to me. Uh, use this. Absolutely Hollow Knight inspired, yeah. I kind of like that you buy things with your health. That's kind of interesting. Who goes there? Who dares come near me to be beat flawlessly in one shot without taking a single ounce of damage? This fucking thing that I got was not worth half a heart, by the way. This thing sucks. It doesn't do shit. Fighting denial. I know a thing about denial. I'll show you a thing or two about denial. Okay. This shit that it makes you, like, you have such shit range. Like, it makes you stand, like, right next to him. So you can't, like, really predict what his attack's gonna be. Okay, got pissed. He's pissed. He's pissed. I'm sorry. Dude, I thought he was only gonna come down after... I thought he was only gonna drop after, like, he saw that I was underneath him. I didn't think he was a timer. Okay, we go one more. We go one more. We go one more than I have to... Then I'm fucking tired and I need food. Nah, that was a bullshit. Nah, that was a bullshit boss. That's not my fault. I just didn't know the mechanic. This one's flawless, though. This next one's flawless. And honestly, that thing that I spent three hearts on was not worth it. Like, I had a chance to shoot in three directions. I don't think I ever hit something with one of those extra shots. I think that was completely useless, after all. You know, I want, I'll, I'll take the first thing. I don't, I'll care, like, I'll pay as much money as possible. I will suck and fuck the guy who made this game for just one upgrade that gives me extra extra range. I swear to God. Will we get VOD? Yeah. I'll leave the VOD up. Do these disappear if you don't pick them up? Fuck me. Okay, I'm walking in. Game name? Oh, dude, chat would absolutely love to tell you the game name. They've been saying it all night. Increases luck and chance of the fine HP pickups. Okay. Damage of your bullet increase the longer they exist. <gasps> Range? Increased fire rate while moving. Range sounds very good to me. Dude, this is like not even different at all. It's exactly the same. I'm gonna have to suck this is like not even noticeably different. Oh my, and what, what just hit me? I don't even know what hit me. Scan. Apparently that's a yes into the souls moving. Got some armor. Okay. Thanks for coming to the stream. Have a good one, my friend. I have to offer my heart for this one as well. Half a heart. Let's go. We got a uh, dash cool diamonds released. Okay. Doesn't seem very good to me, but whatever. We're walking into giant spikes. What hit me? No, they were giant spikes. I didn't even see them. Oh, 
would have seen that if there were giant spikes, just FYI. You half of a soul segment. What is this? How do I switch between my items? And he's back on one heart. It's strategic. I'm increasing the tension for the sake of the stream. For the viewer experience. This is Lily Mega Man. This is very similar to Mega Man. Hello. Shit. I'm trying. I'm trying not to let the uh, the soul like disappear. Oh, I see the spikes in the ground now. Okay, that all makes sense to me now. Okay. This takes me to the shop. This game looks kind of easy, not gonna lie. I agree. I'm about to beat this in one go. One three five pickups blessed plus ten damage for one heart. We take that. Some armor, yeah. Two. Ki wow, what a great deal that was. Uh, should I heal the half heart? Oh no, I should because it's the boss. Level up. Okay, this is half a heart more than I had last time. A boss cell are you up to in dead cells? I don't even think I do more than one usually. I haven't played. What the fuck? I wasn't even out of the cutscene. It let me move. I didn't know it was gonna let me move, but I'm still in the cutscene. Oh, it didn't take my health though. I don't think it took my health though. I'm beating this guy's ass. Here we go. Okay. That was a little bit dumb. Oh, sorry, I have the, uh, the armor, I forgot. You fuck off, bro! It's, like, so inconsistent, like, when is he gonna drop? We'll do this now. I see. It's gonna feel how many full health, right? After I beat this, right? Right, right, right. Easy. Second try. Hello, how was the food in Japan? And uh, how how was the food in Japan? My friend went and said it was good. Food in Japan is so good. Very good. Idea. Can't wait to go back. Additional repression. Okay. So I did not heal me to full health. That's rather unfortunate. Um, you know, hit a boss, you get a free arc. Okay, so that's like Gungeon. Got it. Sir, upgrade my gear, please. Three high pickups. That was pretty good last time I got it. Your dash clothing gets reduced. The oh, I need this. I want this. I want this. Thank you very much, my good sir. I'll do it. 
Oh, he took my health forever? That sucks. Can I leave now? I'm gonna go this way. Okay. Be careful you use permanent from this. Yeah, a little late. A little late, buddy. Fun gated funnels. <sighs> I'm so tired of streaming. I'm so tired. We gotta we gotta lose this right quick or beat it quick. I can't even lie, I'm so hungry and I'm so tired. I need to be free. This stream is a terrible idea, but I'm gonna come back tomorrow and do it again. Honestly, I should have used my reset on Gungeon. I can't even lie. If I had just reset that first Gungeon run because my luck wasn't that good, I would have won. I would have beat. That was really my biggest... My biggest... Uh, oh, my fucking soul's rolling away. Come back. My soul ran away a little bit. That's so sad. I only have one heart container right now. I'm trying, I'm like working towards a, a, a bigger one. That sucks. These guys have a long leap. Keep that in mind. I'll be grabbing a soul. I'm gonna regain my heart container here, buddy. You gotta, you gotta understand how it is. I gotta euthanize you. Let's go. We got a heart container bag. It'd be funny if you and Blue just swapped video styles, like for an April Fool's bit. That could be funny. You're weak. This is all our tower has left of us. Will you accept it? Please restore us. Yes. Do I have to really, like give him somewhere? I have to take him somewhere. Okay, I'll take that guy somewhere. Shoot down while jumping. You jump higher. Listen to us and do it. Oh, look at that. We're right. That's cool. Dashing through enemies will damage them. Your bullets have a chance to burn enemies. Will this kill me? Oh, my armor can help me. Okay. It's first I'm playing Revita. This is my first time playing Revita. I've never played the game before. I'm trying to get like very like busted and just like fucking like powerful out of my mind by just picking the the maximum mention every time. That was not good. I'm trying to make like break the game by just choosing the maximum like uh, sacrifice every time. What is this game? This is Vivita. Is that what this is called? What was it called again? I forgot. Vegeta. No, that's wrong. Max is always not always the best one in my opinion. Get wrong for that. What would it cost the most if it was, uh, if it wasn't the best, huh? Explain. Okay, that guy goes far. What just hit me? Oh, I'm pissed. Was 
Is the grub on the ground? What's the games in the thumbnail as to Hades 2 and Slay the Spire 2? Neither of which are out yet. I clicked the YouTube. I apologize, but it worked. And you're in here now. Welcome up. I've been doing this for five hours. I'm very tired, and I would like to... Uh, I'm getting off as soon as I lose this run, or beat it. Whatever comes first. Probably beat it, because I'm insanely talented. Love the concept of hearts as currency. I think it's cool, too. Each card increases your damage for that room. Opens locked gates. Uh, for a full heart? I don't know about that, my good friend. But I didn't just use a key to get in here. So some cost fallacy is winning out. Love your videos. Thank you very much. So I talented and proceeds to take damage. So giraffe, I don't need to hear that from you right now. Welcome to the stream, anyone who's just joining. You are listening to me at my absolute lowest. This is what I sound like when I am dead and tired and have not eaten food in very long. And what? Um, I've lost all of my my comedy, all of my commentaries, abilities gone. It's left me. You do not care about health, lol. Just like real life. I can go for a nice. Uh, try to whiskey right now, I think. I think that'll make me feel better. The platform here for me to stand on. He was a Ravita. Yes, what he said. Just want to order him a pizza. I think I have food downstairs. I don't even know. The Mushroom Man! Ew. I've not been streaming for six hours, have I? I started streaming at five. Thank you for the donut, by the way. I saw it. Give me a sec. I gotta read it in a sec. I saw six hours. Nah. Is it six hours? Oh my god. Why did I do that? Die, sir. Bah, run. Shut up. You don't know anything, dude. good so far. I took the one bit of damage, but that was kind of bullshit. It wasn't even my fault. Okay, I took that bit of damage too, but that also was not my fault. Kill this thing real quick. It's going to be annoying. Oh, okay, so that splits off. You need to die fairly soon, please, for me. Game easy, bro. I don't know what to tell you. Is the the game people have been killing for you to play? Yes, it's the one. Uh, regain one heart. Good shit. Increases your damage multiplier by five. Good shit, boy. Are there going to be more videos on the anime channel? Probably not for a while. I don't even know, dude. I'm like I've like passed the stage of like I don't know like really thinking that critically about a lot of anime. I just like watch them for fun now, you know? Seems so monotone and boring. Yeah, that's, that's where we're at right now. What's up, dog? Get a good look at that. Uh, damage of your bullets increases the longer they exist. Your trash cooldown spawns three to five pickups. Duration, your bullets have a chance to burn enemies. Uh, I don't think I want any of these. He just this he upgrades the things that I just picked up that I just found, right?
I don't want any of these. These all suck. Am I gonna beat this game? I, I just be like second. The, like this is. If you could switch bodies with someone, but they would also come into your body, who would you choose? It's for six hours. Oh God! Like Jeff Bezos or something? Just wire all of his money to me, or like wire a lot of his money to me? What the fuck's Jeff Bezos gonna do to me in 24 hours? Nothing. He doesn't care. Um, are we talking about Japan again? Someone mentioned Osaka. I lived in Osaka, or Nishinomi, right next to Osaka. But I went to Osaka very frequently. Cool city. I made a video about it. I guess you watch it. I'm so tired, guys. I'm I'm really I'm putting my all. I'm giving my all right now. This game is fun. Oh, there's spikes on the ice there. I'm so doomed, bro. I'm so doomed. What's your favorite word? Um, my favorite word is... Uh, pera pera. From Japanese. It's very fun to say. It means fluent. That are like. Oh, there's so many of those words that are just like the same sound that repeats twice in Japanese, and I love all of them. Um, there's pera pera, gachi gachi, kari kari, doki doki, mucha kucha. There's a lot of them. They're, so, they're all so fun to say. I wish we had more of those in English. You like Chin Chin? I do. It's another good one. Good job. Good shit. I offer you recover HP when entering the metro. That's all you can give me? Fuck it. Spikes to my left, icicle up there. Okay, we're good. Okay, icicles respawn, good to know. Let's go, we got damage up. Let's go. When did I take damage? What? Oh, I offered them the shrine, didn't I? I'm doing very good, by the way. I would like to point out that I'm kind of kicking this game's ass, and none of you are appreciating me for this. I just feel like I have no supporters in this chat anymore. Everyone just wants me to lose. Pin the game name. That would be a good idea. Cause people keep asking the game names. Fuck! Shit! Ooh. That is going to do it, boys. I will be back tomorrow if I have a single ounce of energy left in my body to finish this out. Um, thank you for coming to the stream. It was fun. Uh, I made like fifty dollars in donuts, so that's <laughs> yeah, that's all I care about, boys. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. It was fun. Thanks for coming out. Uh, we'll do this again, and I will uh, not suck as much next time. Thank you for coming out. Uh, do I have anything else to tell you? Um, no, but I know what song we're gonna end the stream with. I know it. You know it. It's. Hang on. You guys know. You guys know how we have to go out. There is one way. There is but one way. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. And with this, boys, it has been an absolute pleasure.
It has been an absolute pleasure being your streamer today. I hope you guys have a wonderful night. Thank you, American. I have no idea what you're saying. USA! USA! Alright, thanks guys.